Welcome to the full blind playthrough of Cold War. Surprise, it's a little earlier than normal. The good old multi-hour playthrough that only a select group of people are going to want to watch. I felt it made sense to play it now for a few reasons. Maybe I'll talk about it when we're in a mission. I'm also just excited to give it a go, see what goes down. I've heard some good things, that there are some twists and turns, but I know nothing at all. I haven't even read the challenges. Don't care about those the first time through. Well, let's go, shall we? It's got to be realism, of course. Enemies are lethal. Uh-oh. They always talk that up. Veteran, you will not survive. Yeah, right. If it's like Modern Warfare, I don't expect it to be very hard. Realism ain't no realistic. There's a big difference. But maybe this is realistic. I don't know. It said lethal. We'll find out real quick. Epic 80s montage. Spirit in the sky. Am I getting copy striked already 20 seconds in? Thanks, Treyarch. We must realize that no arsenal or no weapon in the arsenals of the world is so formidable as the will and moral courage of free men and women. It is a weapon our adversaries in today's world do not have. Let that be understood by those who practice terrorism and prey upon their neighbors. Some U.S. intelligence analysts believe America is already in a state of war with the Soviet Union. Are Soviet spies living among us? 52 American citizens have been taken hostage at the American Embassy in Tehran. An unnamed White House official claims that a Cold War disaster could be just around the corner. Mr. President, we have two names linked to the hostage situation. Arash Kadavar and Kasim Javadi. Just give the word. It's time to send a message. There will be no more hostages. Okay. Sounds cool. Where am I? Who am I? You sure we can trust the police, Adler? This guy's done more for less. He'll look the other way. Hello. Glad you could join us, Hans. You remember me, sir. We cleared a move on the target. Kasim is in his apartment, but he's well protected. He's well protected, but with the right team. For 15 minutes. I hope you brought an army. I am an army. I am enough. Come on. The woods is itching for We don't want to let him down. I need to turn the volume up because it is quite low. I don't know why it's so low. It said 50. I can't jump around like crazy. Unbelievable. We're on the clock, Woods. Not good. I wonder if they made the other half of the room. Party favors are in the trunk. Recognize that voice. Even though it's not exactly the same one. Right, the trunk. What do I want? Ah, the MP5. OP. I can only take one. Now, ah, no. Nope. I'm sticking with the Milano, I guess. <laughs> Time's up. That piece of trash is a lot of things. It's safe, ain't one of them. Good to know. I'm sure I'll forget about that when I am lost later. Seem as info we need. Everyone else can take a powder. Apartment's just up ahead. Hans only bought us 15 minutes. We need to hit Kasim hard and fast. Let's go. Okay. Let's help bring in the new year. Light him up, Mason. We well, just killing them all, huh? Go, go, go! I guess I could have looked for more people. All right, now it's a bit loud again. Okay, I think it's realism, not realistic, and this is going to be quite easy because uh, they said the enemies were very accurate and lethal, and so far they are not being that. I knew I wasn't supposed to do that. Or was I? No, okay. That was like a weird fade to black where it, it seemed like it might not even... Might have not been a mistake. Takedown system. 
Press V, hold V, okay, well. Fascinating. If I stop holding V, I can stop holding V, okay. And... Interesting. <laughs> okay, that's a messed up checkpoint. I get to try it again. I need to learn this mechanic to have fun with it later. So when I do grenade, I just like push it into his shoulder and it, it stays with him somehow. I don't know how that works. That's fine. Alright, so if I'm being dumb, you know, you die pretty fast. Fair enough. And this guy every time. I'll do the takedown this time. Damn. Are headshots basically a kill no matter what? If so, easy. Shotgun time. Is there any intel to find? I need my stim shots. I already feel like searching around for intel and secrets. I'll definitely come back through and do that. I will surely miss almost all of it. Oh yeah, this is easy. I keep trying to stim. Yeah, we're kind of slow. Go, go. Hurry up. Damn. Nowhere left to run, see. We can work so hard. Punch. You're up, Mason. Yes. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait. Where are the other drugs going? Where is he? Tell us where Arash is, and you'll live. I should handle the money? I have no idea where Arash is. You're lying. I understand the situation. <coughs> Ouch. You Americans have rules? You have rules? You took I don't have rules. The rules changed. <laughs> Talk or you're going over. Wait, wait, wait. He's in Turkey. He's meeting someone in Trap Zone Airfield tomorrow night. Uh, Who's a rash meeting with? Uh, oh, I swear, I swear I don't know. They only communicate <coughs> with coded messages. Okay, no more Batman, I'm sorry. Just four on the rooftop. Evidence collected. Uh, oh, okay, we got a choice. Release, throw, capture. Do I have infinite time? <laughs> Is he gonna choose for me? Hmm. I don't know, are there any ramifications for this at all? If I, ca if I co have a collection of bad guys? I guess I'll start capturing them. Gotta catch them all. Let me know if you need some help looking for it. Hudson. Buy the book. Capture him. Okay. He's in trap zone. I don't know. <laughs> I don't think that affects anything. I don't. I don't really see how it would. Are there gonna be a lot of choices? Out of the picture. That's kind of cool. Before we get a rush. The team arrived in Turkey a few hours ago. They should be in position shortly. Looks like some trailer scenes might be coming up. Airfield's just up ahead. Let's go find this shithead. Priority is to ID a rush before things go hot. I <laughs> so I can sprint. I can slow sprint. Mason, check it out. Any sign of barrage? Mm -hmm. That's not him. That's not him. Nope. Nope. Coming truck. Left side. Get eyes on it. Well, of course, we had to wait for the truck. Oh, he's got a, an identifying tiger shirt. That means he's an important character. Oh. And he's doing crazy things. Okay. I agree. 
Hold fire. We need a positive ID. Yeah, I'm positive. It's in. That's our man. There you go. Bye. I'm gonna miss, aren't I? Uh huh. That was right on target. This mission would have been over kind of fast if I hit him. You know, these guys are really not accurate at all. I thought they were perfectly accurate. Alright, epic chase. I'm kind of surprised at how quickly we got here. Is this still the first mission? I don't know where I We quickly took a guy down on a roof and now we're already in a vehicle chase uh, chasing down a plane. Holy moly. Not a lot of build up, I guess. And we've taken out the people in the top, so they're now going to do a barrel roll. Use our CXD, here we go. Oh, okay, it looks like I'm about to get crushed, so not a good start. Accelerate, I understand, okay. Yeah, I kind of just got rolled over. Stop rolling over my car, good thing that doesn't matter. We got a boost. Stop, stop running me over. Oh, 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 ah! Oh, well, too late. I'm, I'm pressing, oh, I have to keep pressing it maybe? Yeah, I've been holding it. How effective was that? Pretty dang effective, wow. I can't crouch. I'm supposed to watch. Whoa. Well, we've gotten through about half the trailer scenes now. Didn't even know. <laughs> Precious will watch the west. Oh, we don't get to catch him. Hudson will want to hear about this. Let's sweep the tarmac for survivors and get to Langley. I was gonna have a collection of bad guys. Who the fuck is Perseus? I guess that's what the game's gonna be about. Okay. It's the high action intro. 1943. Detailed information from the Manhattan Project was stolen from Los Alamos by the Russian spy known as Perseus. 1968. Vietnam War. Viet Cod soldiers orchestrated by Perseus attempted to steal an American made nuclear bomb from a U.S. firebase. Five days ago, while on a mission, we acquired intel that Perseus is in play again and planning an attack on the West. Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. Mr. Hudson, we're all aware of Perseus. We're also aware he's more myth than fact. I mean, personally, I think he's nothing more than the Russian boogeyman. General Haig. Allow me to introduce the man I suited to respond to that. CIA clandestine special officer Russell Adler. He's one of the few people who even come close to capturing Perseus. Uh, Mr. Adler, why should we take this Perseus threat seriously? 
You don't have to, sir. <laughs> yeah, then a lot of innocent people are gonna die. Why do you say that? Sir, every time Perseus has come into play, it shifted the balance of the Cold War. And after 13 years of silence, if he's active, something big is gonna happen. Something that will affect the free world. Hudson and Russell Adams. I know their names. Who do you think approved their last mission? Is the threat real? Yes, sir, we believe it is. Can you stop Perseus? We can, sir. I've already submitted the requisition for my team. Sir, their requests are highly irregular. Most likely illegal. If the press gets a hold... What the hell are you talking about? You know who we are? Every mission we go on is illegal. Sergeant Woods. Plausible deniability is the backbone of our work. Al, we're talking about preventing an attack on the free men and women of the world. Give Mr. Adler whatever he wants. Gentlemen, you've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. There is no higher duty. There is no higher honor. And while few people will know of your struggles, rest assured, the entire free world will benefit. I know you won't fail us. Yes, sir. This is Hudson. How long until we have a lead on Perseus? They're about to get started. Adler's in West Berlin. He should be at the safe house soon. Do you trust him? <laughs> I'm not the one you should be asking, Black. What about his team? It's a strong group. He chased down Sims, Azalei, even pulled some strings to get Helen Park from MI6. We'll get them Mason and Woods soon. I'm not so sure about Park. She and Adler have that business from before. Of course he wants her there. And the new one. Bell? Well, don't get me started. That's the one we need to keep our eyes on. It's a lot of new names. Okay. Oh, I am, though. Am I? Am I creating a character? <laughs> I'm clearly... Harry... Balzac. That text is inappropriate! That's my name! What if my... My name... <laughs> okay, well, that's it then. Uh-huh. We're XKGB. Oh, wait, yeah, this matters. Okay. Wait. Double speed ADS. 25% damage. Longer speed burst. Super stalker. Kind of want that. Flak jacket. No, boring. I'm gonna die anyway. More ammo? Don't care. Grenades? Don't care. Sleight of hand, more health, don't care. No flinch, I think there's already low flinch enough in this game. Low recoil, nah, gonna be one tapping them heads. Higher fire rate, I'm just gonna be tapping though, don't need to burn through ammo. <laughs> Camper perk, okay. Accurate hip fire, nah. I kinda want the, the super stalker. Either that or the faster radius. Or no bonus, just to say that I had no bonus. That's probably an achievement, hmm. But I'll go back through and do all that, so. We'll, we'll have some fun with, uh, I guess just the ADS time seems like the best. Yeah, even though it's the first one. Oh, we get two? Okay, then we're doing the, we're doing the super ADS speed thing. Let's go with that. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I don't care. I can always make a new one, I assume. I don't need to change it. Bell, welcome to West Berlin. We've got a job to do. Harry Bell Cox. I could have made a name with Bell in the middle. God damn Adler. it. 
fell. I could have put a bit more thought into that. <laughs> oh. Let's get started. There's been a surge in Russian chatter in the last 48 hours. The CIA and the DOD Burger Town. their inside sources for anything substantial. So far, there are no leads on Perseus. MI6 has come up empty-handed as well. And we'll have to start somewhere. So we're going back here. Vietnam, 1968. One of our closest encounters with Perseus. Shit. Some part of me always knew that mission wasn't done with us. Pull up everything we've got on the attack in Da Nang and run it past Park. She'll cross-reference it with MI6. We're looking for code names, encrypted transmission, Russian activity with NVA, anything that could be a lead. Got it. Bell, this is where you come in. As ex-KGB, it was a risk to bring you on, but we needed to think like them. And we need that mindset <laughs> again. Head right. to the evidence board. Next KGB. We trace our steps through Da Nang. Anything that could give us a lead on Perseus. That's it. Seems to select the next mission. It's not linear, huh? The evidence board. Replay, examine evidence. Okay, interesting. There's a lot to this. Did not know. Harry Bell Cox. <laughs> so, it's not even funny. I'm disappointed in myself. One out of one. We found all the items. Easy. Okay. Well, it seems like we only have one right now. We examine the evidence. I skimmed it. Gamer time. Alright, Bell. We're going back to Vietnam. First time Perseus pinged our radar. It was late January 68. We were a joint CIA SOG task force embedded within the 3rd Marine Regiment near Da Nang. SOG was there to sniff out Soviet activity. And word had it, Russian operatives were active in the region. Perseus had no known presence in Vietnam. That changed at Da Nang. Somehow, Perseus knew about Operation Fracture Jaw. Fracture Jaw? That one sure went sideways. We launched out of Camp Haskins. Yeah, I'll never forget that shit. Good. We want those memories. No details too small. A face, a name. We're looking for anything that can lead us to Perseus. This feels like looking for a needle in a haystack. In a field of haystacks. Maybe, but that needle's somewhere. Remember, we had a job to do. Hmm. Fracture jaw. That one sure went sideways. Ah, some echoey, dreamy voiceover to make sure you know this is a flashback. Bell. It's time to wake up. I think it is, right? They said we're, we're taking it back to Vietnam. Flashback mission time. <laughs> XKGB in Nam in 68. Mm. You find a marksman in spawn, you take it every time. Welcome to another day in the life of Camp Haskins, our little oasis in the middle of this godforsaken shitstorm. You're pretty safe here. Pretty safe. Hey, Butcher. How's the arm? Still hurts like hell, but at least I can move it. At least I can move it. This is as fast as I can go. What you read? Hey Sims, you know reading that shit's gonna make you go blind. Yup. That's why I want it all up here. Bell, you're with Sims. You usually bring out the best in each other. We got a new assignment. FOB4 Ripcord is holding a vital asset. Charlie wants real bad. What kind of asset are we talking about? kind you don't ask about. Ripcord has been taking a hell of a beating, so it's our job to secure the asset and get the fuck out. Relax, we got fast flyers providing combat air support for this mission. It'll be a walk in the park. Headsets on. It'll be a walk in the park, he says. All birds check in when ready. Badger, Niner, one. 
I think that means it will, in fact, not be a walk in the park. Hell yeah. Because you're a smart guy, Sims. But the news isn't bad. In fact, it could be very, very good. The asset of Ripcord is going to have to wait a little while. We're breaking off from the Armada, taking a detour. And that's good because... A source tipped us off that there may be a heavy hitter in town. A Soviet operative known as Perseus. Oh, shit. Appreciate the enthusiasm, Sims. If our source is right, we could be looking at an Intel gold mine. First time Perseus pinged our radar. Approaching the village now. I was like getting nuked. But it was just fast travel, alright. Focus fire on the courtyard. Focus fire on the explosive red barrels! Look at them. There's a barrel. Just gotta look for the barrels. Whoa, that went through, through the helicopter. Yeah. Wow, they are right on us. Oh, I meant the air mark. Thought that was the M16. Ooh, I like that. Look at that. Ooh, I chose the right perks. It was fun. I probably didn't choose the right perks. There's probably some meta I don't know about. Alright, I don't need a burst gun. Yeah, this is the play. Let's just use this the entire game until we run out of ammo. You ran in front of me. I keep getting distracted by the marker because it's at the top of my screen. And I keep looking up like, where is that? But it's just telling me where to go in two dimensions. I'll get used to it. Let's see. Ammo. Okay. We never have to ditch our DMR. Nope. Let's do a takedown. Never mind. <laughs> Oh, you have to hold for a while for the body shield. Huh. Wasn't there a perk about hip fire? I guess that would have been good for doing this. Oh, you can aim though. I just haven't been. Alright, see ya. Really, they stand no chance. <laughs> I don't think that was a headshot. This thing is just powerful. What was that? <laughs> Am I immune when I do takedowns? Ah, I was charging him. No, okay. I will maybe take this a bit more <laughs> seriously because there was no checkpoint. Understandable. I mean, it wasn't a very long time. But Modern Warfare was very liberal with the checkpoints. I'm kind of down if I have to take it seriously, you know. Like if this was actually realistic mode with the 1 HP, that would have been kind of fun. Would have taken a while though. <laughs> Couldn't have been one video. And I guess for the editing side, I'm glad it's just realism. Yeah, not like I was super keen on editing another campaign right after the Modern Warfare thing. But this will be fine because I'll be excited to get it out there and uh, I'm not sitting on it for an entire year. That was the problem. Yeah, I forgot, I said I might talk about why I'm playing it now, actually in the launch window for a change. Because, yeah, normally I'd expect to be super busy, wanting to make stuff about the multiplayer, grinding all the things, but not many challenges require much explanation. And as for the grinding, hitting that level cap really is demotivating. I already wasted tons of XP in that big double week. I ended up not playing that nearly as much as I thought, because I got most of my guns to level 40, and just didn't need to do anymore. I had everything I needed to do plenty of camo hunting in season one, and then there will be plenty more double weapon XP events to max what I've left. 
Yeah, as much as I want to be getting Dark Aether, like, it would be fun to rush that out and have it for Warzone and do the other Dark Matter 2. It just feels so wasteful when I'm at a cap. Even though the level and keys aren't that important to me, I guess mainly I want to have something to do in Season 1 if I'm gonna need 200 ranks or whatever it is anyway. Oop. I'm dying, aren't I? <laughs> this guy at the stairs. Oh, goddamn, there really are no checkpoints. Okay. I mean, it's not a hard section. I just have to not be bad. I just wanted more time to talk, that's all. Yeah, I know, I'm getting all 200 ranks that I need for whatever challenges. Sounds like it could get boring unless I have some fun goals to still go for. So, I've really stopped playing until Season 1. It sucks for that to be the same as last year. Sort of squashes the launch hype for me as soon as a cap is hit. But at least this time there's the light of it changing. Season 1. Oh well, that meant I didn't have much to do this week. So why not play the campaign? There will never be a better time than the preseason. And at the same time, the campaign also has that set of challenges. So I do think I'll want to have played it earlier than the usual summer when nothing's going on. Like, I doubt I'll be making any guides for any of the campaign challenges. I assume people already have if they were needed, but I still do want to do them at some point. So, it all worked out. It made sense. Level cap, campaign challenges, and I also just want to play it. So, here we are. Cool. And I really have nothing more to say, so I hope I don't die this time. Hello. Yep. <laughs> ah. OP. This thing's OP in campaign. No, you don't. Not now. There probably hasn't even been a checkpoint. At least I haven't seen one. Alright, we have the most OP combination of guns right now. DMR for outside, shotgun for inside. I can hear stuff in there. Frank looking for a needle in a haystack. You hear that? It's on you, Bell. Open the door. Huh. Flutcher! Adler, we confirmed it. Soviets on site. You sure? Well, I'm staring at two bodies that sure as hell don't look Vietnamese to me. Bell, grab that comms log. Let's see who the fuck they've been talking to. Hmm. Mission accomplished. We have the intel. Let's bug out. Good work. Hang on to that intel. We're coming in to pick you up. That the only intel that matters? What about all this stuff? That looks like it could be interesting. Keep looking up at the dang marker. Oh, hello. Alright, that was probably a checkpoint. I'm not gonna get used to the fact that you just tap it for an execution. It's just a melee button. So there is, yeah, there is normal melee. Get that asset ready for transfer. Weird. Roger that, Niner One. We'll keep the asset safe as long as we can. <laughs> you okay there? Ooh, we're flying. Yeah. No sense here. All targets are valid. <laughs> they don't let you just crash. <laughs> Interesting. I need to test the boundaries all the time. This looks so arcadey. The way the level of detail loading works in this game, it just it seems odd. Things are very low detail. Far away. More than normal. Is oh, I have rockets, don't I? Yeah. Why are they on E? We. <laughs> and I'm guessing they're infinite, huh? Okay, we're spamming those now. We should maybe just go. There's gotta be an achievement for blowing up all the buildings. Those supply trucks. Every one of them re -arms the enemy. Supply trucks. I maybe missed the supply trucks. Oh, they're over there. Haha! -ha. It seemed effective. Can I just go through here? Yeah. I don't know why I thought I had to follow the river. Aha! There's still a truck. Bonk. Badger Niner One, this is Ripcord. 
You need to push back the VC reinforcements before we're overrun. Be advised, we have multiple birds in the air. No problem. I'll just sit here and spam the rockets at them. That works. This is Overlord Actual. We have 10 plus enemy foot mobiles approaching from the south. Over. What just happened to me? I hit the skybox? I think I can't go up there. Well, that doesn't look good. Did I just shoot myself with rockets? What happened there? I feel like I was backing up and like hit myself somehow. Just some soldiers? Okay, over there now. See ya. His name's blue. But it says destroy. Okay. Because I was looking at that. Got it. Nice. Yeah, we were really good at that. Roger that, Ripcord. You Adler? It was hard, but you know, we prevailed. Yeah, yeah, hurry the fuck up already. Yes, sir. Thank you. Don't thank me. Thank Bell. He's the one who just snagged up a fucking phone book full of Soviet intel. Let's go. Now. Godspeed, Commander. A fucking nuke? Are you fucking kidding me, Adler? It's a failsafe. That's all you need to know. We that desperate already. Not yet. Okay. Just plop a nuke on our helicopter. Good thing they didn't shoot us down. Never mind. <laughs> ah, you're not. You're you're bye bye. You're you're not though. <laughs> Somehow Perseus knew. Somehow. Sims, Bell, you okay? <laughs> We're okay. Not anymore. Before we're overrun. Ooh. I'm dying. I guess I'm not looking far enough to the side. Okay. Yeah, let's uh, look all around. No, can't look to the left. So mainly the middle and the right here. Yeah. Gotcha. Jack of all trades. I don't know what that is, but I I got kills with a lot of different guns, I guess, even though it's only been a couple missions. It's my OP stalker ability. I really don't want to reload that. Uh, there we go. Oh my. This is getting kind of bad. <laughs> and I got RPG'd, but it looks okay. We are okay. Bell. Still with us? Danger close, Jesus. Got our little nuke friend. You think we can call this a success, Sims? At least the nuke didn't go off. More importantly, we got intel on Perseus. <laughs> okay. Told you we had a job to do. It ain't done yet, not by a long way. Four hours Yo. later. How did the memory exercise go? Well, to hear it from Adler, it's working. Bell remembered finding that encrypted intel in Vietnam and has almost finished decoding it. Anything useful in there? Some names, apparently. Possible leads. Park is trying to connect the dots. We don't have much time. Does the team know about our 
mishap in Berlin yet? No, but if it's connected to one of those names from Bell, they'll find out soon enough. You won't let that happen, Hudson. Don't say anything more than necessary. That's never been a problem for me. Hmm. Weird. So we did some kind of flashback mission, but they're actually talking about it like some kind of memory exercise. We canonically did a flashback mission. We finished analyzing the names Bell acquired at Denang. A nerd. One in particular stands out. Anton Volkov. He's a Russian arms dealer working out of East Berlin. Admittedly, his connection to Perseus comes as a surprise. We've got killer capture orders on Volkov. Looks good. So if we can't get to Perseus, we'll get to his men. Close off his resources, force him out of hiding. Mason and Woods are still wrapping up business in Kiev. Which means Volkov is ours. Gear up, and we'll move out. Cool. Okay. My strong to capture brother and I know. He holds answers to a I'm looking around. Here to entertain me. What you got? Can I buy some upgrades? Nah. I'm sorry we had to relive that mission earlier. Yeah? Uh. Talking about that mission was tough for you too. Hell. I don't know what I'm saying. Of course it was tough for you. You went through that shit like everyone else. Yeah. Why did you guys request me for this team? Hey, I'm not gonna judge. You might have been red once, but you did us right in the war. Maybe sometimes you gotta be on the wrong side first. Am I right? <laughs> Good. Oh, that's all I get to ask. I recorded yeah. some separate dialogue for your character choice. Interesting uh, little detail, I guess. I nope. It's just teasing you. There's really nothing down here. Maybe there's a series of Easter eggs you can do to open things up. What you got? That until you found in Da Nang was treasure trove. I must be missing something, because they're acting like I just found it. Wasn't that like 13 years ago? And we didn't look into the intel until now? You worked with Adler yeah, before. For a short while. We share a common interest. Though to be frank, he's not the most pleasant person I've worked with. All there is Perseus confirmed. Anything else about Anton? Born on the coast of Leningrad, never travels when the sun's out. He has impeccable taste in scotch and medieval torture devices. Mm. I think he'd love the UK. I plan on giving him a personal tour. More Adler intel. No more we need to know. To, I'll tell you that. Avoid personal questions. And whatever you do, never ask him about his scar. Yeah, he's got that scarred face. Bad guy confirmed. Will you tell me? After we dug it up, you spent two full hours decrypting everything inside. You seem to think Volkov was the name to pay attention to. Oh, did I? My bad. Sorry, I forgot all about that. How did I get that do scar? You think that if I knew, I would tell you. Yes. I think you would tell me about Adler's car. There was like that cutscene that said they had some kind of history. Thanks. Are you feeling I all decrypted right, it all myself? Like I That's questioned one that. That's the reasons we wanted you on this team. Not even the CIA's best cryptographers have been able to crack that dossier. You're special, Bell. But it also sounds like you need a nap. Right. My bad. My yep. Pleasure. Sorry. Um, it's almost like I've forgotten my entire life up to this point. Almost as if I took control of it an hour ago. Ah, they've brought back optional side missions, Red Circus and Chaos. Should those be a part of this? Hmm. What are they like? Is it going to be way too short if I just fly through the main missions? Well, we should definitely try one of them. Maybe we'll do them all. A couple as Mason? I mean, MI6 sure. MI6 has spent the last year tracking a group of embedded Soviet agents within multiple European governments. So there's more evidence to find. There are suspects. Uh, it's definitely her. Look at that creepy look. Ah, I must choose three suspects. Her. No one else. Just her. <laughs> uh, I don't know. 
Trust, no thought. Is this kind of serious? Well, I mean, I'll do another playthrough to get things right. I'm supposed to examine the evidence and like, am I supposed to come back here when I have more evidence or what? I don't know. Listen up. I'm kind of just flying An through this. A CIA operative named Robert Aldrich has gone rogue. Langley believes this asshole is working with Perseus to assemble a spy ring inside U.S. borders. So I can't do it yet. If we decrypt the protection on this disc, we might be able to take down the entire spy ring. This is why we need you. Show us those skills. Aha. Uh -huh. Code is clearly 7481. Passphrase is poopy. Yes. <laughs> ah, yes. Access granted. No, okay. Fascinating. I don't think we're going to figure all of this out in this playthrough. <laughs> but very interesting. So we have this intel. Right. Should I not? I mean, we'll try this. I don't, I don't care if I get it wrong or whatever. <laughs> we're probably supposed to do these later. Or I don't know what's going on. You all know what's going on. Apparently, I'll just stop talking. Lying low in a remote Soviet base in the mountains of Uzbekistan. Not remote enough. We're gonna land our boys nearby and pay him a little visit. Let's cut this Perseus sucker down to size. No good. Seems like there's a lot to these side missions. I don't know why they'd make them optional, unless you're just supposed to choose when to do them after you know. Oh well, <laughs> we'll see. We're in position. What do we got? There's an airmail package ready for delivery. Just need an address. Go ahead and mark Ooh. the radio tower for us. Basically, the towers up above would have far range. I see. So okay, the side missions are maybe going to use like multiplayer settings. Unless there's a lot of that, and they just made the maps based on the campaign settings, which is pretty standard. Binoculars, huh? Three. Okay. Looking at the tower. <laughs> now get down there and eliminate Rudnik before he escapes. Thought I was gonna pick him off. Slow motion. I didn't really want full action. Let's go with that. Down we go. Maybe should have made it safer first. Ignore me. Just let me rappel down here real quick. Well, seems kind of fun. Ah, the barrels. Do they not? Oh, they're on fire. There we go. They don't blow up quickly, though. Okay, this will take a bit of time. Let me get across. What? I was like, let me blow that up because it looks like it's going to blow up and, you know, it's going to be dangerous. I was apparently close enough already to die from that. Do not shoot them or blow them up early. Got it. He didn't die from that. Thank you, thank you. Keep clearing them out. Very familiar with this, boys. No. Hello. Surprise. I don't even have ninja, you guys. You should be able to hear that. Blow it up. Yeah. Breach. That tree isn't there. In the multiplayer version. Maybe it is in the combined arms crossroads. I don't know. I don't play. I guess we searched. Okay. Just have to clear the building. Don't have to find anything specific. We looking for the guy. Goodbye. Goodbye. See, we don't really need a, a sniper. Bolt action or anything. You just gotta hit the head. And they're gone. Oof. That could have been very bad. Still could be. Nah. We are professional. Professional. Is this searched? Is that it? Is there an inside? Yeah, we still gotta search. Oh dear. Ooh, ooh. We sweating now. Can't. <laughs> yeah, I deserve that. Hello. 
I was wondering if there's like not even gonna be a checkpoint. Might have been that kind of mission. Kind of like a Spec Ops feel. Hello. <laughs> you are a bit clueless. Is it searched? Only one left? Yeah, okay. How are we gonna get across here? Don't wanna get shot in the back again. Ooh. Can I use it? Yeah. Oh, they're coming out of there. Stop it. That's not a stim. <laughs> I'm gonna keep doing that. Let's go. Can't hit me when I'm going this fast. They can, but it's okay. <laughs> Ran over him. Petroy Minya! Don't blow that up. I'm dead for sure. Hello. <laughs> I gave that a bit of time. That was risky business. Got one. Block. <laughs> Got one. This was fun last time. Nats. Nope. I just took a rocket to the face. Good thing they are weak as hell. Like I was trying to do his camo challenges. I feel for you, bud. Hello? You completely missed right there. Ooh, looks like a breach. Okay, stop, stop reloading. Can't believe this is realism. It is, right? Yep. When are they gonna bring. Oh, hello. When are they gonna bring back that realistic? Let's do it. Ooh, slow motion and everything. Bonk. Kill him? Maybe? Yep. Might have been a capture. Might have messed up. Okay. Landmines. Camera. Maybe we don't want to do that right now. Can I close the door? Hi. Right. No grenade. Ha. Huh. Okay, another one. All right, let's let's do this thing. What are we taking a picture of? Intel. Stop zooming in. You need a clear picture of the body. Right, the body. Okay. I don't think you can zoom out that far. Kill confirmed. We got the pick to prove it. Maybe next time we can draw pictures for them too. Nice work. Evac chopper inbound. Hostiles cool. Your location. Well, that was a fun little mission. Call for exfil. So are the optional missions kind of like Spec Ops missions on the? Oh, oh my. How far do we need to get? Okay. You get in this? I totally missed what it said to... Okay, E. This is good enough, right? Whoa! I hope whoever is... Oh my god, look at those mountains. Flickering like crazy. How about I don't do this? Sounds like a good deal. Oh, hello! That's some heavy air support right there. This is the jeep I couldn't get into. Take that! There's no 105 millimeter. Understandable. Okay, that was effective. I think. Do I not have my super perks in here? My EDS? Doesn't feel like it. I guess I'm not Bell, that's why. Only Bell has superpowers. All right, I'll just wait. Yeah, I kind of forgot you, sorry. All right, let's go. Hope <laughs> I can't die in here. Didn't exactly clear out the area. So I don't really know what happened with the random suspects I selected. We went in and killed that guy. So what happened there? I don't know. <laughs> okay. Well, we eliminated Rudnik. Let's do the next mission. How about that?
I'm gonna assume you don't want me to read all that every time. That'd be a lot. Volkov heads the Russian mob that moved into East Berlin once the wall went up in 61. This guy has connections to cartels throughout Europe and the Americas. Neutralizing him will not only hurt Perseus, but the global syndicate. He's a big fish. And here's our little fish, Franz Kraus. According to MI6, he's one of Volkov's information couriers. Here's a drop of Volkov scheduled for tomorrow night. We'll infiltrate East Berlin via the U-Bahn. The ghost station on the other side of the wall has the access point we need. From there, we'll watch Kraus as he enters the city. Once Volkov shows his face, it's killer capture. Sounds good. I'm liking this so far. I think the, uh, the kind of like stealthy spy missions are, are always the cooler ones anyway than like the all-out military action ones. It makes for much more unique locations and situations. So I like this kind of stuff. We just passed under the wall into East Berlin. Get ready. Warum so traurig? Du bist schwanger. Das sind tolle Neuigkeiten. Nicht weiter auf deine Mutter. Sie hat nur noch einen Atomquake im Kopf. Das ist die Luft. Ist das das? Doritos. <lacht> As the train slows down, feel it. I'll jump off. Part Lazar. Wait till the next station. Bell and I'll track down Kraus. All right. Train slowing down. Let's go to work. Doritos, though, that was just because, like, the partnership thing. <laughs> it's funny to throw their old logo in there. Have I got other brands right. in on it? Here we go. Okay. Careful. East German guards still patrol these abandoned stations. Cool. Patrol ahead. We can use a train to let fast train. Stop. Stop right there. Smack. <laughs> you know I had to. I don't think I'm moving fast enough. It's a long train. I guess I waited too long. Now oh, we're fine. We're fine. Moving on the platform. Ah oh, yes. They are bail boxing, Dick! They want me to body shield. Do I have to? Take it slow. Let's do a silent kill. I don't really want a body shield right now. There's only one guy. Hello. I was gonna open it under the cover of the train noise. That's why I didn't bash, but it was kind of like a bash. Come on, this is the way out. Up we go. Into the rain. Oh, we were just, you know. Yeah, we were working for the railroad. That's a spagabit. Sie sind verhaftet. Rund auf dem Boot. Hold, hold. Let's figure something out. Yeah, right. Okay. Now. <laughs> Telekinetic grabbed his gun. Nice work. Let's clean this up. I wanted the MP5, but I'll take that too. <laughs> right over my shoulder. And drop. <laughs> That's kind of ragdolly. I like it. I like being on <laughs> so. I am strong. Just up you go. <laughs> Why is that such a great animation? Yeah, you can go down here. Blop. Whoop. <laughs> I dunk him back down the. Oh, yeah, we left the grate off. Please, please let me dunk him down here. Oh, no, I dunked myself. Whoop. <laughs> How close can I get? And drop. No, I mean I could go down there with him. I'm sure. Okay, I'm like I'm I'm on over top of the hole. Ah, oh, it, it looks like it could. 
It could. Come on. Ah, uh, it's not gonna happen. Alright, we're going down. Please tell me. There's still trains running. I don't think there are. They were pretty frequent before. Oh, uh, you can now you can pick them all up? Could I do this before? God, I'm just a maniac. Yeah, there's no train coming. But <laughs> I've done the psychopath achievement. Dump all the bodies onto the subway track. Let's get to the rooftop. Yeah, we should do that. <laughs> Sorry, just had to take care of a few things. Park, Lazar, we're almost in position. Copy that. Come on, this way. Careful of the spotlight. Hurry up. I know how to lock a place down, I'll give them that. Keep an eye on that checkpoint. Kraus will be coming through any time. Look for Kraus with your camera. Camera it up. Damn. Security's even tighter than usual. If they detain Kraus, he could miss his meeting with Falkov. Oh no. Near the checkpoint. Man with the briefcase. Is that him? Is it? Good job. That's our man. That's Kraus. Looked familiar. The mustache. He's on his way. On me. <laughs> what? Yes, this man is smuggling uh, giant pretzels and bags of Doritos in his fucking trunk. We're gonna have to stop you. Highly unusual. It was really brightly lit, too. They wanted you to see it. That absurdity. Didn't take a picture of it, though. What if that was an achievement? Oh, no. I'm just going to assume everything was an achievement. Here I am looking up at the marker again. Where am I going? He's down here. Okay. Just an artistic shot, you know? Our intel says Kraus and Volkov will meet at the bar across the street. Meet Hudson's contact inside. She'll have a blue umbrella. Right. Don't mind me. Go to the bar and meet the contact, Bill. Oh no. I just wanted a pretzel. Bonk. Yeah. Hello, blue umbrella person. What's out here? I know. Nasty. Wie schön, dass Sie es geschafft haben. Kraus is at the table over my right shoulder. Activate the listening device. High tech. Audio is loud and clear. Now we wait for Volkov. Hudson didn't reveal much. He said you're after Volkov. Hmm. The police are out in large numbers tonight. One of my informants was picked up in a random sweep just two blocks from here. The Stasi must assume they are more nearby. Hmm. I would ask a favor of you. He will not hold up under torture for long. We need him rescued. Or... Cut that. Silenced. They're holding him here. Okay. I'll see what I can do. Danke schön. Optional. <laughs> cool, it's optional. How long will the cup be in Berlin? Who knows? The men's like a ghost. I would guess no more than a day. Like a ghost. It takes over every man he touches. What do you know about the courier over there? Kraus is ex Stasi, so don't let his wholesome appearance fool you. The man is a killer. 
Heads up, Bell. I think Volkov's Well, we exhausted all the chat options, so I assumed he would be walking in. Damn. Bell, we've got trouble. There's two studs entering the bar. They know. Get out of there now. Monka. Go through the best room. I'll hold them off. Back to Mr. Vomit. There had to be a reason we could open this. I'll just, I'll just stay here and ambush them. Oh. <laughs> okay, we're going through there, clearly. Meet outside Krause's apartment. Oh, I can't reopen. Yes, okay, I'll open up. Out we go. Stealth. Ooh, stealthy time. Okay. Gotcha. I'm gonna need more time. Rally up with Lazar Park without me. I'll update you when I can. We waren auf dem Heimweg. Locked. Pick lock. What if I kill them real quick? Nobody will find them. That was not exactly the best idea, but you know, it worked. Ah, lockpick simulator. Yeah, that's exactly what it, it's like to pick a lock. <laughs> they sure are. One of these mannequins is gonna come alive, I just know it. Ouch. Oh, there was a guy in here. That's not the optional save guy, right? Just some random guy? Hello. No problem. Keep a low profile, you say? What if I just kill everyone all at once? There is no way I can take these two out without everyone noticing. But I want to try, you know I do. Oh, he's- no, no! Clueless! I love it. You're welcome, other guy. We oh. informant. Okay, this looked like parkour. Yeah. Oh no. So he he's the only one in there. Otherwise, our cover is blown. Hello. Yeah, this parkour is pretty clear here. Bunk. Bunk. Uh oh. Whoa. That's okay. But it's not. You know I want to do it stealthy. We might be able to take them all out. Use the camera to tag enemies. What? Informant. Is this the optional guy? Let's try going in here. Oop. I am stuck. Ah! Bark, give me a sit rep. I'm in a storefront facing Krauss's apartment. He just got home. You? The stars here come in the area. I need to lay low. I'll catch up with you when the heat dies down. Bell, that guy was fine. Oh. Is this pickable? It is? Okay. Oh, there are two now. That makes a bit more sense. Except this is still extremely easy. Only two, you say? Just, just let me go. <coughs> Please. Ah, hello. I told you. I'll just read that over your shoulder here. Too sick I am. Yeah, this makes sense. <laughs> I've seen no picture. 
Okay. They're looking for you. Hello. Goodbye. <laughs> what happened? I'm showing a nearby KGB field house. I, I don't know how they found me. I've done everything by the book. Rescue. Shoot. Note. You were careless and can't be trusted. We're done with you. Note. What, what, what did that paper say? You, you can't trust these people. You're the one that tipped Volkov off. I don't even know what you're talking about. Please, just let me return to my children. Okay, Lalo, don't make me regret this. I'll be waiting to hear from you. I shoot him now. Okay. We collected the things. Off we go. These two, let's go back up top. Aren't there bodies right there? I swear I killed the guys behind that car. Okay. Whoop. Parkour. Big hearted. Aww. Hello. What's with your problem? Oh, well, don't use a unsuppressed. That's supposed to be a silent kill. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hi. There's a guy. Hello. Hello. Was I not completely spotted until that noise? Because that's kind of funny. Can they figure out this door is the question. Yeah, okay. Well, now I'm just hunting them down. Music's a little calmer. Maybe they're all done. Easy. <laughs> Alright, no problem. That's your low profile, Bell. God help us all. Follow me. Just casually kill all of them. Stay quiet. We don't want the locals writing us up. Parks in the electronics store right across the street from Krause's place. <laughs> I can't take picture. Out of film? Oh, I had to be zoomed. <laughs> I can't be that zoomed in on a uh, little porter there. Weird. Huh. Oh, I got one. It's a popular graffiti. We're back. A car pulled up near Krauss's building a few minutes ago, but I didn't have a good angle to keep. Just a moment. Krauss is on the telephone. Bell, get eyes on Kraus. What do you think, Lazar? Sounds like Volkov wants Krauss's briefcase. We should place a tracker in it. The case will lead us straight to Volkov. One of us can sneak into Krauss's apartment. Avoiding Krauss and his wife might be the greater challenge. Bell volunteers. I we'll sure do. Check around the exterior for any unwanted guests. Bart, you can keep an eye on us from here. <laughs> I'll try to give you my best angle. Well, we have to play. New game discovered. How many of these are there to find? Accelerate. Oh, that was loud. Oh, Lord. Ow. <laughs> the audio of this game, it's so quiet in cutscenes, and it's pretty loud in the gunfighting. And this is just miles above everything else. Ah. 
Let's accelerate some more. Ah. Ah. Okay. Oh, you're not. We don't lose. Ah. Okay. How do we? Uh. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, I think we're we're done with that for now. Can I please? Okay. That was way too loud. <laughs> Bash. We out here. Bell, I saw Kraus writing in the ledger. See if you can find Bam. it. Bell, if you're spotted by Kraus hey. or his wife, the mission is over. This person? The mission is over. I'll keep that in mind. No camera, no gun. Ah, toasty. I think we're supposed to go up there, probably. I can't hear you, sir. You're gonna need to speak up. Yeah, there you go. Oh, uh, right back to his miming. You can train the wife if you have to, but Kraus must go to the meeting. Ooh. I'm about to phone Kraus's apartment. Get ready Ooh. to enter. Well, I mean, you know what I have to do. Not that. Okay. <laughs> Unfortunately, the application has unexpectedly stopped working. Well, let's see where it saved my progress. Oh, that's a lot of missions we've done, apparently. Resume. It'll probably be from whatever checkpoint we were at. All right, good. Yeah, there's a radio in the door for some reason. <laughs> We are speed running now. Look at how fast we got here. When I'm not messing around. Apparently I'm horrible at this. Huh. Nice work. Now find the briefcase. I'll get it. Hello? Took me light here gives us kind of prayer. Big closet you got here. Edda, suchst du mir meinen Schirm? Ich gehe in ein paar Minuten. Can you get me an umbrella? Yeah, that triggers as soon as we go there. Ich gehe in ein paar Minuten. Ja, Franz, er ist hier im Wohnzimmer. Ich lege ihn neben die Tür. Mama, ich finde meine Decke nicht. Then find it. Uh oh. There's a kid here. Ooh. Uh-oh, kid room. Beach ball. Yeah, what what kind of things do kids keep in their room in Berlin? You know, a fully inflated beach ball. I guess. <laughs> I don't know. What was that? We sneaking. We collecting. Ooh. Aha. I can't close it again. Close it again, dang it. Why would you not? Good for you. Have a look around. <laughs> okay. Wow. Secret. I hope I'm doing this in the right order. Amazing how there is no marks on anything other than the secret puzzle. What if I just do them quickly? Ah, that was it. I've lost a visual. Uh huh. 
Did I not close this? Oh. Bell, have you found the briefcase? There are photos of what appear to be nukes. Uh. Oh dear. <laughs> yeah. Dang, guy is ninja perk. Unbelievable. You allowed him to break into your apartment. I, I, I can't explain how he got to the materials. But I brought him to you. That makes this much less unpleasant for you. Perseus has been looking for this one. Then you let Perseus know I captured him. We have greater killer as well. Her own colleague read it out. You spineless piece of shit. I'm Damn it. His pockets are deeper. Finally. As soon as they threw in the thing about him having kids, I knew he was a bad guy. Perseus has a large bounty on your head. You have a large glasses on your head. Go fuck yourself. Good thing I don't care about her at all. He gets it easy. Do not tempt me to bring out my toys. I will ask again. Who do you work for? Sounds kind of kinky. I want to see those toys. I've been sent to eliminate you. And what makes me suddenly worthy of your attention? Go fuck yourself. What kind of fool are you? You think you will die with dignity here? Oh. We agree to a hunch. Uh oh. Yeah, the court. So what if I didn't investigate the closet with the noises? What if I just tried to leave, but I still get hit? And what if I killed that guy instead of letting him go? Would she have been captured at all? I'll the case. There are choices that matter. It's kind of cool if they do. We back in it. With our super bell power. Oh, oh throw it back. Yep, yeah, they are perfectly accurate. Instant death, these enemies. Interesting. Oh, I don't have a secondary. Really don't need this when headshots one shot, but you know. Let's hit some some sick shots. Ooh. You do it for the slow motion, that's why. This is gonna be an interesting gunfight map. It's like aisle nine. Yeah, I think it's we've had our fun with that. Not practical. Are those below up? They're red. That's how you know. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, I tend to do that. Ah. So, here we are. You and I. You and Go I. Ahead. Take me out. It's what you are good at, is it not? <laughs> I didn't know if that would kill him, but you know, <laughs> whatever. I guess we're not having a collection of all the bad guys. One of Perseus's men off the board. Is it? I wanted him alive. MI6 could have gotten so much more out of him. My bad. Can't win them all. Now let's get the hell out of East Berlin. I didn't know his light would just switch off when I shot him in the leg. Information from Volkov confirms their worst fears. Perseus smuggled a nuclear device through East Berlin. We can't be certain of it yet. He has it. I'm sure of it. We found encrypted geo-coordinates with Volkov's nuclear intel. An unpopulated region within the Soviet Republic of Ukraine. An aerial recon run revealed this. I want to know everything that's going on inside this building. We'll need the others for this one. Mason and Woods will join us from Kiev. Bell, you'll infill here with Woods. Mason and I will be standing by for an extract. Park will handle comms. We have no idea how large or prepared their forces will be, so use discretion if you have to engage. 
It's time we took a peek behind the Iron Curtain. Ooh, okay. I've just realized that I should really have subtitles on. What does that look like? Regular? Yeah, that's good enough. You're in the clear woods. Copy that bark. Stay on comms. Keep Mason and Adler on stand. How many campaigns have I played through? I'm not remembering to put subtitles Let's on. Go. The base is just over the next ridge. Get in, learn what you can, and get out. Shit bark. The plan is Shit to bark. <laughs> See the gulag. Do that afterwards. No comma there. Look at that monster. Red Damn. team had anything inside. Snap a picture. Ops want to see this. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's got the helicopter in there. Nice right. picture. Nah, it's not gonna focus. Ooh, that's that's a nice shot. Photo ops right over. No, it isn't. No, okay. Boop. Ah, Woods, what are you doing? That solves that problem. Take point and head down the slope. I'll hang back and cover. Of course you will. Snap pictures of anything that looks important. Maps. Ah, if it's glowing with a red, white line around it, is that important? Maybe you should have done that. Move into the base. One out of six, optional. Alright, I gotta look for things with white lines around them. I can't go any further. Okay. Find a way to the main building. I'll trail and disable the perimeter alarm. What? Got you covered. Thanks. Shit. Patrol's approaching my position. They'll find a way in. I'll follow around. Bummer. Haha. <laughs> Hmm. Somehow I don't think a hatchet in the backpack would, uh, kill you. Whoop! <laughs> in you go. I like being able to move the bodies. I always want to be able to do that in stealth missions. It seems ridiculous that you just leave the bodies on the ground. Right in the way where people are gonna find them. Wonder how many people I can kill before they... ...see me. Doesn't have slow motion ability, sadly. Otherwise, it would be easy. Could probably tomahawk him. But they're all super blind, so I can just keep walking around the side here. Hello. Mm, they're on the move. Wow. You don't notice the guy that just got shot two meters to your right. You see, I knew that was a bad idea, but I just wanted to see. No kidding. Inside we go. I probably missed some uh, intel, huh? Oh, I'm getting shot. An enemy APC. See that hind? We're gonna take it. Right now. Why not? Okay, how about this time? They get to live. The rest are quiet for now. But I've still no word from Woods. Stay the course and get inside. And I'm gonna make a special effort to not be in the light of that. On we go. Ooh, the five lock. The five pin. Ah, of course. <laughs> I wasn't ready for that at all. <laughs> I was making no effort to You're welcome. save myself there. You lost something. Thanks, Woods. Park. Bell found us away inside, but we don't got a lot of time. Then get moving. Sneak no undetected. Here. Well, that was easy. I'm glad I got killed the first time then. Mm -hmm. 
Guards down below. I'll move to the lower deck and <laughs> Alright, I'm set. Uh, the ones I killed already? <laughs> Alright, I'm set. All clear. Moving up. All clear. Okay. Got it. Be ready. Be a thousand reds on the other side of this door. Cover right. Me. Okay. You're a bit slow to realize that. Not a fucking word, Bell. <laughs> Weird. Is place? It's a Spetsnaz training course. Made to look like <laughs> fucking any town USA. Cool. Get a picture of that bell. Well, this is clearly going to be a multiplayer map. At some point. They can make this into the new Nuketown. No one's going to believe this. Burger Town! Oh, shit. What the heck? Fuck, let's move! I had wall hack. Might play one of the... Oh, there's got to be a game I can play, right? Yeah. It's going to be... Le oh, this is a normal volume so far. It's a similar theme. Meow. <laughs> Meow. Yeah, okay. We gotta discover all the games. River Raid. Ah, classic. Not gonna spend a lot of time playing these. Pitfall. I feel like this is a more recognizable classic than the others. <laughs> Just bleeding points. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know my game history. I feel like I've seen it before. Yep. What? Teleporting scorpions? What's the deal with that? Barnstorming. Amazing that the Soviets went to all the trouble to get working arcade machines in here. There's another one. And that's enough of that. If they want a live fire drill, let's hook these fuckers up. Ho ho ho. Not part of the drill. Yeah, let's take a few out here first. Where's the music at? Of all the times to have some upbeat 80s themes going. Is there a new town Easter egg if you knock off all the mannequins? Clear the first area. Go, go, go. <laughs> I'm just exploded. There's a lot they could do with this place. I'm definitely not hitting all these. Burger Town Burger Boy. Wow. His name's Bubby. Incredible effort. Doritos. <laughs> they went to a lot of effort to make this, uh, they steal a Bubby from a restaurant someone tra transported all the way here. Yeah, there's gotta be a thing for knocking off all the heads, man. Not gonna get it done now. Wow! You could place what the? Order more. Capitalists love to overindulge. So much. Meat. Yeah, <laughs> they definitely went to all this effort to get those lines in English. Great. You're gonna love my meat inside you. No, oh, I bet I will, big boy. Would you like to make that a super duper mega combo? I sure would. Yep. I question your life choices. How many of these are there? Sure you want that? Yes. I think you want more. Yep. I'm gonna keep going until he repeats a line. Will you be my friend? Oh. I think he's done. Okay. It sounded like did he poop this out? Cause I heard a like a noise halfway through that. Or is this just here? I don't know. Whatever. Epic. Ooh, I see some intel. Should I look for more or should I just come back for it some other time? I'm sure I'm gonna be coming back through here, so we'll just keep moving. Hmm, nice refill. 
elevator leads straight to the control tower. Grenade! <laughs> okay. Awkward place for me to be stunned. Oh, is this a juggernaut? Alright, we're just doing the high explosive mission now. Easy. Except I think I can infinitely stagger him. Epic mini boss. Epic mini boss. Yep, <laughs> we sure felled him. <laughs> Alright, I, I liked that. That was a challenge. Realism boss. Good thing we are very good at this game. Up we go! Nice face paint. When are we getting face paint back for multiplayer? Nah, it's all gonna cost 500 god points. I have to hit a button. Yep. Radio chat. What's the camera? We got caught up to some kind of live fire drill. Place is crawling with reds. We're still looking for intel. Bloody hell. I'm putting Mason and Adler on standby for extract. She sounds mad. Does she sound mad? <laughs> Looks like their command center. Come on. Jackpot. Computer central. Let's see Ooh. what the reds are really up to. Bell, hop on that terminal. Start poking around. Nice Welcome point. to the Soviet People's Warfare Analysis Archive. I speak in English for some reason. Hmm. Operation, Operation Greenlight. Greenlight. Restricted access. What the fuck is Operation Greenlight? Bell, can you hack into that? Yes, I am the lead hacker man. I will hack into the mainframe right now. Just let me crack my knuckles. Oh, a password. Look around. These reds ain't that right. smart. Maybe there's something on the desk. Ah. How about that? Ah, a good guess. Nice. The password was right there. We confirmed it. The nuke smuggled out of Berlin is a green light asset. It's one of ours. Yes. Yeah. That gets out. No one will know. Not even Adler's team. The stakes are too high. High is an understatement. We're talking mm. about an American nuke hidden beneath Berlin. Whoa. I want to make sure you're committed, Hudson. The place Whoa. is called. The ball's in motion. Well, if the asset learns the truth. You're worried about truth now? I'm concerned about control of the asset. If we can't control the asset, we end the asset. Game over. Okay. I'm grabbing a copy. This doesn't make any sense. Percy's infiltrated a CIA nuke program, codenamed Operation Greenlight, run by Hudson. Yeah. What's up with that? The nuke is American, and Hudson fucking knew. Time to go. What was unauthorized about that? I put in the password. Mm, let me take a picture real quick. Okay. What are you talking about? Talking about green light. That's what Perseus is after. And Hudson has his fingerprints all over it. What's your breaking up? Just get the hell out of there. <laughs> One of those was different than the other. Ah. That time I didn't even mean to. It was like a, yeah, there's an APC, that's why. That hurt quite a bit. Can I even get through here? It sure is. Feels like they just like... Ah! I was trying to get a good look at the area. I was gonna say it's like they just watched The Simpsons and built it based on that, but it's a very common any town look. And The Simpsons is old, but it's not that old. It's like the 80s. Next to be like a Back to the Future vibe, but that was like mid 80s. Don't think that existed yet either. How many towns are actually like that though? 
It's just like a reused movie set. Could not have a better weapon for this. It's just so OP. You ain't throwing that. It did blow up, yeah. I was wondering. <laughs> Boom! There are so many of these. I'm starting to doubt there even is an achievement. And I know I've missed some, but... Jeez, there are a lot. Sounds a little dangerous to open the door. AKM-16, nah, we're good. Ah, so they made the button animation anyway. Ouch! Let's run by ammo, or only grenades. Hmm, okay. Mr. Jug Boy. I kind of am. But honestly, it feels like I should aim for that toe or something. Like, he, he's gotta have some holes in that armor. Oh, uh, it's one of these. Is that blown up? Alright. Hope that was good damage. Holy! The damage on these guys. I'm gonna need some ammo here. There we go. Oh no. Oh, wait. Give me a sec. I didn't let it focus. Is that okay? Yeah, that's fine. Oh, okay. It wasn't a race against the clock. Ah, we might use this. Go for it. Oh, well, is that an armored guy that just got blown away? Feels good. Let's see here. Ignition. Steering gear shift. Oh, yeah. oh, this is hard to move. I have to do several laps of my mouse pad or just go real slow. Ooh, we can chop down all the trees. Revolution! There goes him. Kill the mannequins! It was a cool area that they made, for sure. I had some fun with that. He sure does. Red light, green light. Yes, sir, I'm on it. Hey, Hudson. You knew the nuke was from green light, didn't <laughs> tell us! What else are you hiding? Maybe I can knock the truth out of you. You might want to rethink that, Woods. Everybody stand down. Oh, yeah. This little pissing match isn't going to help us catch Perseus. Why didn't you tell us it was an American nuke? He needed us to clean up his mess. The bastard's been lying to us all along. It's not a lie. It's an omission of fact. That's what you do best, isn't it, Hudson? Manipulate people. Tell them your own version of the truth. There is no truth. Only who you choose to believe. Adler knows all about that. Don't you, Russ? Operation Greenlight. What is it? Tell us everything. Back in 58, the arms race was in full swing. Eisenhower was convinced that the Reds moved on Europe. We couldn't respond quick enough. So he authorized Operation Greenlight, a top secret program that placed nuclear bombs in every major European city. The ultimate countermeasure to a Soviet invasion. 74 of the bombs were upgraded to high yield neutron bombs, capable of terminating personnel 
without damaging infrastructure. Thousands dying in a flash. You're talking about fucking infrastructure. How's that for civilized? We kill the people, but preserve the buildings. We're trying to preserve our way of life. How long have you known about the missing nuke? One of the Greenlight nukes went offline eight weeks ago. We suspected it was Perseus, but couldn't confirm it. So we saw the photos you brought back from East Berlin. So, there's an American-made nuke in the wild. And once Perseus detonates it, the United States becomes global enemy number one. We wouldn't have this problem if you'd done your job. Killed Perseus in Vietnam. Careful, Hudson. Next time, I might not stop Woods. Not the best plan to scatter nukes all around. We need to know what Perseus is planning for that nuke. Park? Anything else in that printout Bell and Woods pulled from the base? There's mention of an excavation taking place in the Ural Mountains, Yamantau. Our insider within the KGB confirmed an active operation. Yamantau? I thought Hudson and Weaver buried that place years ago. We did. Perseus wants to salvage the old mainframe. Dragovich and Steiner must have left some good shit behind. Steiner. Send me in Woods. You're too close to this, Mason. We can afford zero fuck-ups. Bullshit. You know there's no one better for the job. It's my call. I want Mason and Woods on this. Nobody better than Bell. Find that mainframe before Perseus does. I'll contact our KGB insider, Belikov. He'll offer logistical support. Hell, Belikov may want to fly the chopper himself. Whatever Perseus wants. It Sounds like down. the Black Ops universe Nikolai. The first building is just over that ridge. Thanks, Dimitri. We'll radio we found the mainframe. Woods, you know what the KGB does to double agents. Yep. Da. If they win this season, it's almost worth facing the fighting squad. He wanted a hat. I have only one hour of fuel. So after that, you find yourself a new ride. Come on, let's get moving, Mason. Right. Nice place. That's our inside man. Don't let the smell of cheap vodka and caviar throw you. Belikov is the real deal. He knows where all the bodies are buried. Hell, he buried half of them. This feels like a very confined area, the way the rocks like end there and just... I don't know. I guess we're on a peak, so it's okay, I mean... I can just picture this, like, floating in the middle of nowhere, in a skybox. Woo! That was way too fast, <laughs> considering how sharp of a drop there is there. Heads up. Scout's on the ridgeline. We should drop him now before we get any closer. Sounds good. Hold up, after playing, I've now seen the clips where he says, I'm a goddamn onion, Mason. We do this quiet, Mason. Yeah, you're the expert in quiet. I'm a goddamn onion, Mason. You should know that. First of all, what the hell does that even mean? You have layers, because I don't know why onions are quiet. Obviously, it's ridiculous, though, because everyone made fun of it, including James Burns, of course. You see that onion? We're gonna peel it. Hilarious. Second, what did I do wrong to not have him say the line? It would have been funny. Good kill. Nice. Let's keep moving. You take one, I'll get the other. What if we let them pass? Yeah, let's go to slow mo. You got him? Damn, Mason, save some for me. You weren't getting them. Shit, this looks dicey. But hey, if it's good enough, the Reds. You go first. Oh. I thought we were going. I'll go first and second again. We good? <sighs> I hope this holds. Yep. Jeez.
Yeah. That's the old SATCOM building. Still standing after all these years. Barely. Seems familiar. Let's keep moving. We break into one of these in Black Ops 1. Smash through the window. See any more? Yes, I do. Sniper, take cover. Shit. I can't get shot. Mason, take him out. Good thing I can. You're useless, Woods. Ah. <laughs> really? Woods is in front of me. Got one. <laughs> you sure did. <laughs> right on the other side of the box. I think we're in the clear. Damn. Look at this place. Is this actually a remastered area from Black Ops 1? Is that why they're reminiscing? Mm-hmm. Oh the god. We find the <laughs> the crossbow bullet is gonna give me the numbers. What about a crossbow bullet has triggered my sleeper agent uh, training? Soviet engineering at its worst. Ooh. Yeah, that was safe. <laughs> Oof, the slow motion just makes it too easy. That's the doomsday bunker. We're getting close to the mainframe room. We'll cross on that cable. Those reds on the helipad have some serious Woo. It's not like I super recognize the place. I can picture like the scene of smashing through the window. Cause that get that gets reused a lot. I don't know the Black Ops games as well as the Modern Warfare games, for sure. In terms of recognizing things and Knowing all the characters? Oh dear. I have made a horrible mistake. Oh, that was supposed to happen. Okay. I could not have cleared them out in advance. Ouch. Ah. Got a knife. I forgot I could be, uh... Never mind. I was gonna say I forgot I could inspect. But I... Can't Copy seem that. to do that. Woods. Great. Great. Anything over here? No. I see a long hallway. I must go down. Hmm. <laughs> Heavy breathing. Oh. Damn, it's cold in here. It does look pretty cold. Oh, I got it. Didn't even break the glass. Magic man. Nice. Oof. Goddamn. Unpleasant. Oh! Yes, I am getting shot. You might want to cancel that. That! Why don't you come through the door? Oop! Uh-oh. Alright, how about you come through the door? Hmm, smart. But not smart enough. I guess I'm supposed to be taking one of these. Ooh. What do we have here? It's locked. Locate the key to the weapons locker. Hmm. One of the guys have it on them? Is it hidden? Kinda want my knife. It's in the trash. I'm not really gonna look for it super hard, I think. Yeah. Recurve bow. <laughs> Alright. There's gotta be like a sticks and stones achievement for using only the knife and the bow. Now that we've been given this. Which I've already ruined, I think. Mm hmm. Oh, 
<gasps> Bet this opens that weapons lock. A key! I found the key! It wasn't that hard, actually. I just had to go a bit further forward. Well, I gotta go back and open it, even though I don't want the weapons. Perform five stealth kills. Oh, you didn't hear that, huh? Sorry. I have the key. What do we got? Well, look at this. The numbers. The Redeemer. Nice. I guess we should use it. Pull the people again. Ah, shotgun. I don't think I need to get a headshot for that to one shot kill. Yeah. Off we go. I kind of ran through there quick. Anything interesting? Yeah, maybe. But not immediately obvious. Okay. Over here. Hello. What the ruckus you made? I'm surprised the entire Soviet Union ain't up our ass. You've been busy. That's what they pay me for. Survey the dig site. You see any dig sites? Yep. This one. If I'm reading this map right, swing a few degrees to your left. Map says that crane's hanging right over the atrium. Puts it in spitting distance of the old computer room. That's where we need to go. Let's do it. Have you found the mainframe? There's a big crane on the west side of the base. Have your winch ready. Excuse me? My my winch? Sorry, you're breaking up. <laughs> yep, sorry, can't hear you anymore. If we don't let <laughs> you explain crane, that you don't have a winch, chopper. then you must have one. Okay, it doesn't the one shot no matter what. I'll let him do some stuff here. Like your Fourth of July, huh? You're welcome. Fire. Bad idea. Back up we go. Okay. He's competent. Now oh, we got an easy checkpoint now. It's like that first mission. You just had to get through the whole area, which wasn't hard, but a bit unusual. Hmm. Hmm, not good. Yeah, okay. We are leaving. That turret really is hurting. But <laughs> that hurt him more. God, this thing is good. Actually a lot easier to be using than some full auto thing that gets a bunch of hit markers. Uh-oh, where? Okay. God, this thing is so easy to use. Just upper chest. Or just any any chest. Gotcha. <laughs> oh, that... Mm, okay, no, no, no. We'll make it across. Careful with the gunship there. Okay. Good thing you're blowing up those barrels. Takes me way too many shots. Ooh, that stuff on the slide. You wanna go forward, Woods? We see you, Dimitri. Hold on. Whee. Okay. <laughs> nice ragdoll. <laughs> I love it. I'll never be mad about ragdolls. <laughs> they could have made him kinda like do a little roll and like try to grasp at something, but no, just ragdoll. Ooh, I got my stims. I got my stims. Would that have opened no matter what? Or is it because I had the key? I don't need your fancy zipline. 
Didn't need to use that. But. Oof. If I had these all the time, if they're recharging, just too easy. I should probably be saving them for when I actually need them, not just using them when I can take cover whenever I want. But that was fun for a bit. Pick up the pace, Mason. Pick up the pace. What am I doing? Dimitri, Here. The witch. It's like a gulag rescue. Huh? <laughs> yes, we're just going to go back to our miming practice. What was that supposed to be? Remember what they taught us in mime school. <laughs> we're going to put on a performance these boys won't forget. Ah, that's what it was supposed to be. Hello. Okay. Well, that makes a little more sense. Ah. This hurts. I can't go prone here. Oh, there's a wide open there. These barrels don't help me much. Oh, they do. Never mind. I tried shooting them earlier and it took several shots. Yeah, Velikov, jeez, I'm just getting roasted out here. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm glitching through the wall. I'm falling out. Maybe a different weapon would have been better for this scene. I, the stims would have been good for this scene. That's Yeah, jeez. Why didn't I save my stims for this? I don't think taking everyone out really matters. See, if I could go prone, this would be fine. But I really can't do much. Ooh, this might be tough. This might be a little tough. Alright, so just... Can I take cover from whoever's shooting? Blow up the stuff. So, oh, I maybe blew that up early. They didn't come out yet. Okay, okay. Just keep reloading. I only got nine shots. Eleven. Can't count. Ah, wasted my ammo. Tried to blow that up. Uh, and I'm hurt again. God damn. Okay. Hmm. I think my other weapon's a bow, so that doesn't help much. I glitched through the wall again. I can kind of glitch through here. Depending on the direction it's moving. Weird. <laughs> it's so glitchy. <laughs> oh my god, I'm outside! Whoa, we are swinging! <laughs> I found a weird uh, pattern I can press. <laughs> if I just if I try to walk in a circle with it or with oh my lord, this is not exactly the peak of the campaign. <laughs> All right, heal up, heal up, heal up. Is that clot? I gotta remember where they come from. Wait, 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 wait. Barrel, barrel. Hit the barrel! Oh no. No, 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 no. Bad time to reload. Yep, smash the side. Smash the side. Shake him up. Oh, there's a barrel there. Oh, that's bad. A bad time to reload. We might be done. We might be done. Fuck! We got pretty far. This is pretty hard. Without stims. God damn it, I'm a moron. It's an interesting trial. It's like a very Spec Ops vibe where like you clear a floor efficiently then you you have some time to reload before the next wave essentially the next little aim trial failing poorly. That can hurt unexpectedly because I survived quite a bit the first time. It's hard to really take cover here because you just glitch around and like yeah, see, I can't, it's not like I have to stay in a corner, you know? I just have to kind of stay back here and kill them before they kill me. I did not kill anywhere near as many as I normally do, but I guess my evasive maneuvers have been working. Reload, reload. Ready for the barrel here. Now I'm getting shot too much before I can hit that. And we are floating away! We are floating away and I am gonna die! <laughs> Jesus. There is actually an AK here, which I was too stupid to notice this entire time. Unless they just spawned that because they felt bad for me, but I'm 
I, way more likely that I'm very stupid. It's honestly not going to help that much. It'll help hit the barrels and not need to reload and all that. And like just hitting them staggers them, so this is probably going to be a lot easier now. <laughs> I was doing that for no reason. Great, great, wonderful. Oh, well, I'm still going to die, okay. Yeah, there are guns here the whole time. I feel like I saw that too. I, I, I saw that and was just did nothing about it. I don't know. No, but I'm, I'm not Bell, so I don't have super aiming powers. There's two. In a way, the Magnum is still better. All right. Okay. Stop. 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 I have to get these people. Stop glitching. How can I get them when this is happening? You know what? I feel better that the ARs on the ground really aren't that helpful. It's not like I could have just easily knocked this out a while ago. Blow it up. Can I like pre-frag one of these areas? Uh, I gotta get these two first though. Yeah, I only have two though. It does help. I should really save it for this. I can't, I can't get all those. There's so many people. I think the main meta is to hit them, not kill them. Don't need to kill them. Nice if you do, but not necessary. Next up is Big Launcher Room. This is where it gets crazy when it slams there. Hit the barrel. That didn't really help. I just have to shoot barrels when I see them. I think this is a new record. New, new PB, new PB, but it's getting too crazy. <laughs> I just keep going back and forth. I'd, there's nowhere to take cover. I went crazy with frags there, but it just doesn't happen fast enough. I honestly think, like, I should restart this mission and get my stims back. Like, this is just insane. Can I skip back a checkpoint? I don't think so. No, she's always going to put me back here. God damn, what do I do? Like, this is actually crazy. I know the barrels to shoot. There's breathing room here. It's fine. Like, this part's fine. As soon as it slams into the wall, it gets crazy. Yep. See Woods just teleport across the screen? I guess he's got the same problem I do. Like, there's no way I can clear that. Look at that. Oh, there are so many. All I can do is try to shoot some barrels. Unbelievable. I think I'm pu pulling the plug. I don't know how to do this. I don't know how to do this. I don't want to change the difficulty. I'd rather just restart. I'll give it a little bit longer. Don't think it's intentional for the realism difficulty to go from it's just easy to almost impossible. Like I would get this eventually if I just kept throwing myself at it, but I don't think I'm really developing any more of a strategy. Like I know where they come out. I just can't deal with it fast enough. See, why does that blow up in one shot sometimes, but it usually doesn't. It stays on fire for a while. Just, just crack, just, just fucking flick to every, every single person I see. Snort G Fuel. Cracked, cracked out, out of my mind. We're doing shockingly well right now. Hurry up, Balakov, holy crap. Oh my god. It just takes the panickiest, flickiest aim to tag every single person. I almost restarted the mission. And we just get it right there. Wow, that was unbelievably hard compared to everything else so far. Just a walk in the park and then that. Wow. Okay. Give us those names. We'll get Adler's team to track them down. Perseus Eraser. Tragovich? Someone say Tragovich? There's only one place you're going to find that information now. The Lubyanka building. What? KGB headquarters? Why didn't Perseus get them there himself? I don't know. Maybe he's operating without authorization. I'll let Adler know, but we're gonna do this the right way, or we're not gonna do it at all. Okay. I mean, I like there to be some challenge. That was a bit of an odd one. With <laughs> the glitchiness. Just got word. Belikov is back in Moscow. You guys know the plan. Bell, you with me. Lazar, be ready for exfil. Are you taking him into the KGB with you? Are you crazy? 
Wait for Mason or Woods to return. I don't need Mason or Woods. I need Bell. He's got the skill we need. Hell yeah. Are you enjoying this? You're risking the entire operation unnecessarily. Hey, it's not I'm right unnecessary. Here. It's calculated. I'm the best one man armor you've got. Understand that if you botch this, we can't get those names. It's over. Mm hmm. I know you can do this. Hudson doesn't trust anyone he can't control. Thanks, Adler. Do some digging. Okay, our evidence board is getting pretty filled up. Okay, took a bit of a break to uh, celebrate beating that elevator of doom. Have you come to convince me that you should be headlining this operation? Yes, I recall we were going on something important. I'd like to know the reason behind well, your reservations. Short of it is that you're the wrong person for this op. How dare you? I hope you prove me 110% wrong on this. I will. How well do we know this belt? That's on a need-to-know basis. And from where I'm standing, there's no reason in hell you need to know that. You're to make contact with him and follow Adler's lead. Okay. Will we assume we fake can't identities? Take the time to fabricate them. <laughs> Belikov will get you uniforms. And from there, you'll need to improvise. Strategically speaking, this board is on insanity, which is precisely the type of work we rely on Adler for. It'll be easy. Either as Adler's most trusted ally, or as cannon fodder. Negative. Digging into the KGB's most classified database would blow his cover and burn years of posturing. He'll get you in, but he won't go near that list of names. Understandable. Bye bye. Excellent proposition. Yeah, shut up. Okay. Let's pick that mission. Are these side missions? Let's just go for it. The Lubyanka building, KGB headquarters in Moscow. The sleeper agent records are stored in the archives 100 feet below ground in a nuclear defense command bunker. Your only way in or out is through this high security elevator. Ooh, cool. We'll need proper credentials. That's where our asset, Belikov, comes into play. Belikov has been our source inside the KGB for nearly a decade. He'll get us in. He came through for us in Yamantown. He'll do it again. This shit is crazy, even by his standards. You sure he's on board? An immediate nuclear threat warrants every risk at this point. I'm sure he wouldn't disagree. Sims, get Belikov on the line. <laughs> I'm liking what I'm playing so far. A lot of these sneaky spy missions were all CIA top secret sneaking around type of stuff. I think that's fun. Hello, Belikov na trubke. Izvinite, ja dumal što eto pesot po Singapura. Right, nice code phrase. The line is secure. We're almost to the tunnels. Did you get access to the bunker? Uh... I will take care That's of it. That's what I like to hear. Ah, I will have the bunker key for you soon. Not yet. I know you have this under control. And one more thing. One of our East Berlin informants recently switched sides and fled from Moscow. We have reason to believe he's in the Lubyanka building today. He knows too much about our Berlin network. I'm thinking an early retirement. Yeah. So what would have happened here if I just killed him? I will take care of it. Now I know why Hudson thinks so highly of you. We'll meet you at the basement entrance once you have the bunker key. Disconnect. Kamra Belikov, you've been summoned to the conference room upstairs. Secretary Gorbachev is here from the Whoa. central committee. Okay. In the briefing with Gorbachev. Did the general come through here? What a nice building. Have you ever been Comrade Belikov, have a seat. General Secretary Brezhnev has taken an interest in the new security development. Zakayev! <coughs> what? There's a mole within the KGB. 
Is that the Zakaev? Imran Zakaev! Oh god. You've not met him already. This is Imran Zakayev. I've met him already. Thank you, Secretary Gorbachev. He has one too many arms. And thank you all for welcoming me with open arms. That'll be solved in a couple decades. I can think of no greater tragedy than a home violated from the inside. The trust and love within a family is sacred. Apparently. Not everyone shares your beautiful sentiments. Comrade Belikov. As head of security, I understand you've practically exhausted yourself trying to unearth this mool. How is that gone? I haven't looked in the mirror yet. Actually, I have a strong lead. Yes. And once we are finished with this mool, he will be as blind and buried as his namesake. Until the mole is found, I want security increased around the bunker. Mm, he knows, he knows too much. Have any recommendations? We should restrict bunker access. We also want to cultivate closer relationships with all of you. I want to know your hopes, your fears, your ambitions. That's cute. Be thorough, but we don't want any significant disruptions. And you, Belikov? Who do you think should retain bunker access during the investigation? Me. And only me. Ooh, put it on him. Zakaev and I. Comrade Belikov, my apologies. Even your bunker ah. access has been revoked. We can't be too cautious, can we? Secretary Dang. Gorbachev, I believe it would be best if only General Charkov retains his bunker key for now. Very well. See to it. Where could I got with the general option? I've already ordered the bunker keys collected from the men. Comrade Belikov, we are in grave danger from the capitalists. Our collective, our very way of life is at risk. The traitor will be caught. And he will pay a high price for his betrayal. Stop staring through me like that. Belikov, you are dismissed. Right. Just casually walk away. It isn't me. Okay. Multiple ways of acquiring a key. Caps lock. I'm being watched. Wow. I need a bunker key. Now, first, I'll have to kill the cameras. There's a guy, like, right behind me. What did you say? Oh, I have to do this. I shall track it. This stuff's cool. Usually there's, like, a, a small portion of missions that are like this in the in a COD campaign, but... They've all kind of been sneaking around. Hello, sir. I'm just, uh, doing some stuff back here. Right, those are all very suspicious things. I will not be doing that. This area is restricted. If I'm spotted oh, here, I'll blow my cover. Ah, now we are supposed to eliminate. Hello, sir. Uh, how's it going? I'm just going to uh, non-lethal takedown. Now I need to hide the body. Nah, he's just sleeping on the job. <laughs> I love how quick that is. Hoop. Uh, hmm. It's a good suggestion. That's I'll pretty much our only option. Lookers. Okay. Well, no. Do I have to open it first? Mm, there we go. <laughs> nice. I turned the light off in there. All right. Mm. I have to get the bunker key. key for Adler. He'll need it to access the vault. <sighs> Unfortunately, Cherkov now has the only one. Okay. Well, let's just go poison Cherkov. <laughs> let's try that. Uh, well, we're not in a restricted area yet, are we? So we can just hang out. We're still friends. That is Cherkov. Let's see. Hello, could I go see Cherkov, please? I'd like to discuss my investigation the with the general. will be questioning a prisoner today, but should be available most of the time. <laughs> Okay. Poison. <laughs> I'm ready to meet the... 
Oh, I need Just to get the poison. Know when you're ready to meet with him. I have a chance to kill Cherkov. Kravchenko's office will have the poison I need. My bad. It's already marked, I think. Yep. Mm hmm. Nope. Nope. It's the wrong way. I feel like I've gone the wrong way again. Okay. I mean, it does look like we're supposed to go down, maybe, to, to get to there. Comrade Zakaev. Oh, no. So, I guess I, it's not too much of a shock. I guess they, uh, they were clearly building toward... You can totally go down here. I just saw the, ro the rope and was like, oh, nope, guess I can't do that. Restricted area. All right, so it's now a suspicious place. Well, <laughs> if I wasn't suspicious already... That's weird how you just slide right in. Huh. Yes, I know. They're clearly trying to make a, a unified COD universe with the stuff they've been doing recently, Warzone story. Interesting. Comrade Belikov, why are you sneaking around in the vents? Where even am I? Okay, I'm way over here. So I could come out in the server room. Don't know why I want to do that, but here we are. Hello. Oh yeah, this is uh, not a good place to be. Huh? Eh, what? <laughs> oh god. Yep. So I could pick that. But I liked my vent meta since I saw this. How about we just go for this guy this time? Instead of letting him see us through the... Well, wait. I could just keep going around, maybe. Nah, nah, let's, just, let's get this guy. Oh, I should wait for him to be done on the, the radio. Don't see why I would want a body shield. Poison tea. Just sitting here. Don't think there's anyone nearby right now. Unless there's that guy inside the uh, server room. Access computer. Oh dear. Nova six entries. Yeah. Mole investigation. Uh oh. We gotta, uh, hmm. We gotta get out of here. <laughs> I left the body there. Whoops. Can't look in there. Alright, fine. <laughs> there we go. Even though he's not dead, he wake up anytime. I mean, if you choke someone out for three seconds, usually they come right back. So, don't know about that. The armory guard has a weakness for Cubans. Okay, perhaps a bribe could get me inside. <laughs> That's not suspicious at all. Hey, you know that mole we're investigating? I think I've got a new lead. Okay, well this doesn't help us get the code. For the lock. If I had a deactivated keycard from the armory, the computer and the data entry could be used to reprogram it into a bunker key. Okay. Three, four, five, six. Yes? No. Okay, darn. Yeah, I'm just gonna do the next thing. Yeah, that's the armory. Hello. Sir, what can I do for you? I'm sorry, Comrade Belikov, but Zakaev has increased security measures. You'll need authorization from the war room like anyone else. I see. Persuade! Well, can I persuade him with the Cuban? I don't have the armory paperwork, so I could try to do that, or I should try to persuade I'm you. sorry, I can't. Zakai would have my head on a pike. Right. I can keep trying to persuade and hope it gets to the cigar. How important is pursuing this lead to you? Ah, a Cuban cigar would be Ah, okay, we were getting there. I'm sure you could find a personal stash in one of the offices. I have something for you. I'll let you in. But this never happened. Okay. We didn't so, need to get the papers. Just gotta keep pressing it. In data entry, I could program this blank key card into a bunker key, yes. Wonderful. To data entry we go. Please close that door so I feel less suspicious. Just go on in. Alright. Ah. Ooh, restricted. Don't mind me, I'm just hanging out in this room. I know how to do that now. Well, we are in a restricted area, so... 
And in you go. I'm glad there are so many empty cabinets around. Aha. Yes. Time to be elite hacker. Like how typing Y took several key presses. That's <laughs> four presses. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, now I need to head to the basement and let Adler's team in. Without killing anyone. Yeah, I didn't need to kill anyone. Where am I going? I got the key, so I can go to the prison. But what about the poison? Do I not kill the guy? Opportunity. It's just an opportunity. I'll just go to the prison. All right. I'll come back some other day to poison Charkov. Or maybe we could have, uh, like, took him down or killed him or whatever. As opposed to the papers, as opposed to the cigar. There's plenty of ways to go. I like it. Oh. Maybe you don't want to see me coming out of the little restricted area. I'll come out of the normal area. Hello. All good here. Open the gate. I'm doing a security sweep. Yes. Blood. Down we go. I'm going to Mexico. Hello. Just doing a security sweep. <laughs> Simonov. <laughs> Simonov. Ah, Adler's team will need uniforms to get past security. Luring two soldiers into the tunnel should do the trick. E to radio guards. Huh. Belikov here. Send a security detail to meet me in the furnace room. Immediately. Hmm. We're gonna take their uniforms, huh? Wasn't sure you'd come through. I don't have much choice, do I? And into the other body we go. <laughs> this keycard gives you elevated access to the bunker. What about uniforms? Shh, sounds like they're here now. Okay, I will lead them through and distract them. You two do the rest. Bell, take cover. Keep it clean. Uniforms are no good to us, bloody. Right. Там, там, там. Я нашел незапертую дверь. Нету никакого оправдания этой некомпетентности. У нас есть очень строгие протоколы, чтобы это предотвратить. Понятно? Okay, I have to leave, but you should have everything you need. Now, if stopped, you are reporting to Commander Sobel. Get changed. Here we go, undercover. Here. And we're Bell, right? We got our superpowers. If I was just some random no-name guy named Bell, and... You know, this was set up as like, if you screw this up, we're screwed or whatever. You, you should wait for Mason Woods to get back. I would think I'm about to die and fail this mission. But they made me like create my character and name him and stuff. And give him abilities. Surely he's going to live the whole campaign. I am very Russian. Hello, hello. Hmm. Belikov's in trouble. Fine, I'll let you out. No metal detectors for us. We're going around. Куда это вы направляетесь? Досмотр обязателен для всех без исключения. We have Commander Sibyl's authorization. Должны пройти досмотр. No. Просто 
Hmm. Whoa, what? Well. Товарищ, доставьте вашу сумку сюда для досмотра. Пойдем, мне нам кое Дайте нам пройти. Не принимайте это близко к сердцу, товарищ. У меня приказ досматривать всех, без исключения. Hmm. This is about to be the, the Matrix scene. Oh my god, it's all guns! Ты нужен за Кайву. Я разберусь. Спасибо, товарищ. Taking a real good look in there. По-моему, я здесь, нет? Save! Пойдем. Good, good. Take us down. Down we go. Oh, of course. Oh, was it guy? No, you did so. Когда вы прибыли? Just today, actually. Ах да, разумеется. Not gonna lie, it's okay. То ваш командир, я не расслышал. Uh oh, I forgot. Commander Sybil. Correctly. Ooh. I thought he said that. That's why I said it the last time. Thanks. It's assholes like that we gotta watch out for. Well, I did know that he survived the encounter, so we weren't gonna take him out or anything. They won't be happy to see us down here. Wait for my word. We are not continuing our disguise any longer. Oh, I could have started shooting earlier, but you were uh, doing something. I don't know. Oh, where do you have that? All right, the shooting begins. This is where the fun begins. Now, I quite enjoyed the uh, sneaking around. The it's unconventional, for sure. I am advancing. Do not worry. This feels like I could be going really fast. Like it's like a mile high club type thing. This should be an achievement for getting through here in like one minute. Unrealism. I guess I'm only thinking that way because it's a, a tube. <laughs> a bunker type thing. Just feels like I could easily be clearing out and rushing through the whole thing. Not bad, not bad. Because I don't know the achievements, I'm just brainstorming achievements the whole time. Nice. Good. Let's get it. Wow. Stormtrooper over here. Oh, this, this spaz is not good. I'm gonna turn the music up. I usually talk about how I want there to be more music, but I usually have it turned down because of the, the other gameplay, so... Why not just have it uh, a little louder? Maybe too loud. Cool. Nice atmosphere. It does not look comfortable. <laughs> That'd be a crime to pick up that body. I like how you can take all of these. Ooh. Huh. Don't have much time before they get through. <laughs> that wasn't very helpful. <laughs> oh, he's gone. Okay. There's the list. We'll Copy it to a disc. Uh, Dragovish. Yes, I should just copy it to disc. Okay. Ah, the old slow transfer. Well, it's going. Maybe we pre open one of these. Ah, good. Lots of ammo. You're almost through the door. What is that? A scope on that thing. Get ready. Here they come. 
<laughs> Alright, not the play. What if I'm here? No, okay. Too close. They had to make me un ADS to nerf me there. This thing is just bad. I think this is gonna be pretty easy. <laughs> just sit right here. I can see them coming. Cancel the reload. Keep reloading. Okay. They really gotta make those crazy buggy elevator scenes to kill me. <laughs> I hear you. Alright, alright. I could've could have got careless there. Could have got me. Uh, no, not gonna do that. And back to reloading. Oh, let him go. Wee. Okay. Are we going out the side or? Well, we gotta push through. Okay. You're locking the place down. Follow me. This way. Hmm. Why is there nobody here? Okay. Blink, blink. Blink, blink. Alder, you. I keep calling him Alder. Adler. You're just running right through that. One of these doors, there's gonna be like 50 people. I don't like this. Yeah, so, so walk back here. How far are you gonna go before you make me go in there? Okay. This isn't Modern Warfare. We don't have fancy night vision. Kind of a dope theme. I'm glad I turned it up. Hey, there they are. Waiting for it. What are you shooting at? Thank you for the flashlights. I guess I could take one. Don't really want one. This might be a way out. Might be. You are surrounded. We have your friend. Got Belikov. Oh. Time for Plan B, Bill. Active. Damn. Yes. Throw your weapons and surrender, or he dies. <laughs> you better get him a mask. Why is he not shooting? There you go. What's the situation up top? They are on full alert. Melting the building down. We'll have to fight our way out. We're gonna need some heavier gear. I know just the place, my friend. The armory. You are alive. These guys got some firepower. Okay. Nope. Ooh, juggernaut time. Lazar, meet us in the southwest courtyard in five minutes. Belikov is hitching a ride. Remember. <laughs> Once we get off the elevator, no Russia. We keep moving towards the courtyard. Get the charge ready, Bill. Hmm. Let's go, Bill. <laughs> I'm an Air C4 scumbag. <laughs> no Russian indeed. But we're not pretending to be American, we just are. Sort of. Where do you think we were coming from? They're looking out there somewhere. I really don't take any damage, huh? Doesn't seem like it. 
The casual hipfire LMG walking. You're actually in no Russian too. Hey there. Well, I'd say we're pretty covered. In we go. You better not cutscene kill him right now, because we were totally fine there. These guys. <laughs> Jugs. Oh, what a oh, there were a lot of people shooting at him. Had to see the slide across the car. Have I just stopped needing to reload at this point? My ammo's gone away. <laughs> I think so. Alright, that's now a movie gun. Oh, there we go. There's the reload. No, no, never mind. Just, just put it down. Okay. I think I got an achievement there. Probably just beating the it's mission. Time. But it We're quickly disappeared. Call. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Yeah, no kidding. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names, despite himself. He's got balls, I'll give him that. Bell did well. Hell yeah. Seemingly. But I think that team is getting too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out, one of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlight. Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus. Just realized we're talking to Black. It's like, that guy's ops that the game is named after. Wow. Bad joke? Yeah. Yeah, like, I'd say we caused quite the mess in Moscow. If the whole plot of Modern Warfare 2 was that some American act of terror on a Russian airport started off this huge war, then why in the Cold War does us shooting up the KGB embassy or wherever we were not cause some shit to go down? I assume they pinned that on America, so... I mean, Recent geez. movements of Theodore Hastings has led us here. Cuba. Right in our backyard. A vacant government facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus, and the likely location of the stolen nuke. No doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who can bring him down before me. Who? Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We are not gonna let him move <laughs> this nuke inside the states. It's time to take down Perseus once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, there's no turning back. Hmm. Is that him saying, do the optional side mission thing, or you're not gonna be able to? Are we getting down to it already? It hasn't been too long. I don't think it's the end. We have all the evidence here. So I could decipher it and put it together. If you do not crack it. His spy ring may escape. Uh, I mean, that's fine. I guess we'll just play the mission. Just to have played it. Uh, I'll crack it some other time. I mean, I'm sure I can just look it up and everyone has solved it, so. Our source tells us that Aldrich is about to move south across Colorado. Don't really want to sit here for half an hour doing a puzzle. That's where we're intercepting his convoy. We can't let a former CIA operative run a Perseus spy factory. Let's put this asshole six feet under. Very nice frame rate in this cutscene right now. It reminds me of Modern Warfare. <laughs> we're going to be scrolling across this map for a while. Music is done. We are just waiting for this to finish. Still going. We're blurring, okay. Oh, please, please, please. It was like a minute longer of that, or more. <laughs> Shit, that cutscene really lagged behind. Ooh, I guess we're not done. <laughs> it wasn't loading during that time, it was just watching the cutscene. Oh, okay. <laughs> I can't believe Aldous betrayed the CIA. Betrayed the whole fucking country. Phoenix 2-4, this is Phoenix 2-1. 30 seconds out. We're up, Mason. Locked and loaded. Hell yeah. Target's ahead, taking the lead. Shitheads think they can hide from us. Time to send a message. 
They're not concerned about what's going on right now. Can't we be lighting them up? Why are we just landing? Are we we're taking everyone out? Okay, yeah. Yeah, it seems like we could have been shooting from above. Oops. We take the right path. Going better than before. It feels like there's some kind of urgency, but that's rarely the case. Don't want to have to reload that ever. What else do I have? Ah, shotgun. Okay. Was that a launcher I saw? Yes, it was. Do I want that utility for later? Maybe. Why not? If you see a launcher, take it. I could have used it right there. Why not? That kind of worked. Ah. There I go, stimming again. Did I kill myself with that flash? I guess maybe I got shot while I was jumping through the window. Ooh, whoa, whoa, look at all these guns. Okay. We'll take all of that, why not? Boom. Give me that slow motion. Boom. You can easily jump out in the middle of nowhere when you have slow motion. Huh. Yeah, that worked better than the launcher. Nice. Works even better when you don't have a bolt action. You can just keep it slowed down. No, I'm learning. Don't do that. Pick me now. Give me a big shooting gallery. Let's slow it down and get them all. Who else? Oh, that's bad. Oh, we are crashing their party, all right. Ah, I have two amazing breaching weapons. One that blows up the room and one that aims down sight like molasses. Hello. Hello. Amazing. The longest quick scope of all time. The CIA family photo album. For the traitor section. You know, the shitty part. <laughs> That'll teach you. Mm -hmm. That's Come good. on, man. It's a photo of a fucking corpse. Got the photo. Well, I wanted it to be all in right. focus. Hey. I can't break the TV. Not in time. Ooh, sniping time. I'm so glad I have this. Haha. -ha. Can I go for a swim? They've got it in the game. Surely they let me swim. Yeah. The first swimming in the campaign. I've done it. Oh, that was a weak ass shot. Where did that go? Apparently I suck at this. Oh, you're shooting at me. You have chosen death. I don't need cover. Find a way up. I found it. <laughs> it's a ladder. Right there. All right, fun side mission, even though I didn't decode the thing or do it properly or whatever. That's fine, I'll do it some other time. Hold on. What's up, Hudson? Make it quick, I'm busy. <laughs> just on the phone. No, I'm just gonna ask you a bunch of questions. What if we find a live new computer? Plan A is Agent Azale. We didn't pick Lazar for his charisma. He's an expert in bomb defusal. If it's live and he can't disarm it, you're still gonna get that nuke out of there. Bring a change of pants. 
Oh my. Infiltrating Lubyanka went well. Indeed it did. Our insider delivered in a big way. As for you, the baseline expectation around here is to surpass every expectation. So from the bottom of my ass, welcome to the team. Thanks. Are you concerned about Woods on this mission? I don't know why I'm asking that. I'm not in the business of discussing my personal views on team members to subordinates. Anything else? Okay, yeah, whatever. I don't want to ask about having a large restrict team. The projector's in the back corner if you need to go over any details from the briefing. I'm back. Stepped away for 20 minutes and dude's still on the phone. Okay, what's up over here? Look alive. It's Adler's protege. Well... Oh, you don't like me? Is there some history between you and Castro? Are you fucking serious right now? <sighs> don't get him started. Nah, 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 nah. Hold on, let me set the record straight. Here we go. <laughs> so yeah, Castro and I have some history between us. I had the opportunity to off the man, but our intel was flubbed. That's in a tidal wave of shit all the way up to DC. So if I find out that Perseus is in cahoots with Castro, and Hudson happens to find one of my bullets in Fidel's head? Well, I say chalk it up to collateral damage. Huh. Kept it under five minutes. I was expecting a diatribe. Uh-huh. Yeah, okay, we've talked to him. Yep. So there's, uh, there's only the two optional things, right? We just go ahead on Perseus here. Right, all right. Let's do it. Hunt down Perseus. This can't be the end. Hastings left Salt Lake City. Tracked his movements all the way to Cuba. We have to assume Perseus moved the nuke there. Langley believes Castro could help Perseus smuggle it into the U.S. in exchange for a peek at the hardware, of course. That isn't gonna happen. What's the plan? The last read we have on Hastings came from 30 miles south of Havana. We suspect Perseus is using an abandoned compound there to hold the nuke. They're working under the radar, so expect moderate security. I say we smash and grab. Parachute in, grab the nuke, skyhook out. And what if the nuke isn't there? It's there. The only reason Perseus needs Hastings in Cuba is to prepare it for arming and detonation. There you have it. Hudson will arrange our exfil while we're en route. If everyone's ready, let's move out. End of the line. That's a fake out. Adler's late. No, love. We're early. Adler should be checking in right about... Park, we're in position. Copy that. We're moving to flank. Fast and loud. Find Hastings, ah, grab yes. the nuke, get the hell out. Real birds. Woods, light up this joint. About fucking time. Go, go, go! Do the honors, Bill. Good for you. Ah. Hello. <laughs> That's like fucking clockwork. Ah. Yeah, the slow-mo ain't as OP with a bolt action. You're just gonna stand there, huh? Ooh, I do want this, though. Bam! Let's take care of this gunner, man. Heck yeah, they are. You're welcome. Aha! He's back. Got him. <laughs> Who needs a sniper? Who are you even in shooting at? Oh, I finally got grenaded. It's like I don't get hit. A lot. <laughs> you know? Even in Modern Warfare's realism, I got hit more than this. I can just run around and like... Nothing hits me. It's a little odd. Even that guy can't hit me. I don't have any cover, you know? There's like enemies all over the place and I'm not getting shot. Isn't that weird? Who else? Who else? <laughs> that was a mistake, my man. He hit me! How dare you! Take your men around back! 
Any optics in chat? Yeah. What did these poor bastards do? They finished their job. Hell of a reward. Guess we're going with this team. They've got closed circuit cameras. We could use them to locate the nuclear bomb. Sharp as ever, Mark. Ah, oh, ripped him. Oops. What the heck? <laughs> okay. Is that the only way in? The secret bookcase? It is. Did I make a mistake? Can I not get into the secret bookcase room now? Can I pull a book? Bummer. What have I done? Oh, there it is. Ah! <laughs> Nice panic room, loser. Oh, there's gotta be something in here. Wow. Okay. No. Just just frags. Unless I'm blind. Which is often the case. Like right now, apparently. <laughs> there are some uh, mines in there. This guy like shoots out of here and then... <laughs> Didn't escape that time. No, oh, there's still nothing here, so... Didn't need to come back. They like this position. What? So I hit disarm, but obviously went off. But I thought being prone would be good enough. Nope. Or not that kind of mine. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Okay. In motion. Yeah. Ow. That wasn't very nice. Old Faithful. I don't know what that was for, but I did something. It wasn't even a picture of an AK, it didn't look like so. We continue. Mm-hmm. Checkpoint reached. What do I even have? Oh. Don't need that. Locate the nuclear device. Mm-hmm. Change feet. Mason, you missed one behind the counter. Thanks, Park. Right. Contact. Keep looking. I was. I uh, wouldn't let me rapidly swap between them. Hold it. Adler, we have eyes on the nuclear device. Bloody hell. Someone's killing the scientists. Second floor, room 27B. Aw. And we're looping around. Okay. Second floor, center room. Upstairs. Let's move. Be there, Mark. Crude, but effective. Can't keep your eyes Crude, me, but effective. Bell used the C4. Huh. I don't have it in my lethal. I just have it. Whoa. Adler, we're moving to the second floor. We're pinned down. Move ahead. We'll catch up. I don't even know if I shot you. Oh, I'm missing. I'm missing. Oh. It wasn't pumped. <laughs> I put it away without pumping it. That is not cover, man. I can't tell. Is it not a one one hit headshot right now? I thought it always was. Mm hmm. Oh. Just Molotovs. <laughs> that guy just. I didn't hear any gunfire. Ah, oh, scientist. It feels like I'm hitting the head and it's not a one shot. Maybe not. Just not accurate. Ho ho! <laughs> yep. That's one way to die. Get in their shotgun range. That they are still decent at. Kill the sniper before he shoots the scientist. Okay. 
Dying pays off. Oh, God. Sure thing. You bitch! I hit disarm. I wasn't that close. I'm doing it. Are you kidding me? One shot is all it takes for the friendly fire because he runs right in front. All right, see, they're not there. There's that sniper. There's nobody there. It's only that one guy we can save, maybe. Because now they're here. I want to try to see if I can get away. I can. Okay. It's not just ridiculous instant death. Oh, chair going flying. This ADS ability is just too good. I like my perks. Ah, yes. The obvious door over there. Hastings, stop talking. Perseus was here. He shot us. Escaped. Perseus would never leave his precious nuke behind. He forced us to reverse engineer the detonation codes. They give him full access to Greenlight. What? Are you telling me Perseus can detonate multiple nukes in Europe? Yes, that is I'm what I am sorry. telling you. Sorry. Hastings. Why did you do that? How many green light devices can Perseus detonate with those codes? He can detonate all of them. Ugh. He'll wipe out half of Europe. Blame it all on the USA. We need to find that son of a bitch, Perseus. Time to go. No this whole green light thing was just a horrible idea from the start. We can use the turrets. Stop him! Ooh. The convenient scaffolding out the window. I can hop up here. Uh-oh. Nice skyhook blimp. Usually doesn't have wind tail things like that. Oh no. They give me another tundra in case I lost mine. Which I guess I did. I'm ready for that drink now. Don't tease me, Park. But we'll have none of that horse piss you call beer. Fuego de supresión! It'll be a proper drop. Get ready. Here they come. Didn't we come from here? Am I insane? Why is it suddenly blocked off? Alright, it's kind of crazy here. So I'll just hang out in my corner. As long as we still tap on them all, it's gonna be okay. Oh, I'm not. Be a little more efficient with your ammo. Oh. What the heck? Am I getting RPG'd from like way over there? Nope. Oh boy. Gimme, gimme you down, gimme down. We going up. Oh, okay, that was an achievement. I mean, <laughs> that was everyone, I guess. Oh, it wasn't that bad. Be ready for extract. You will not get another chance. Copy that, Skyhawk. I can see the plane. Park, we need to hook into the line now. We'll do it in turn. I can't. Bell, you harness up first. We'll cover. Go. That isn't very high at all. We need to let it go higher. Well, they really swarmed back over here while we were hooking in. Well, let's just as quickly and we'll do both. Eight, seven, six, I know soup. 
Yo, save my bro. Even though I really don't know either of them well at all. <laughs> Did I just choose which one would become the villain of the next game? <laughs> now she's gonna get captured and brainwashed with the numbers. Well, that was a goddamn fiasco. You go in with the intel you have, not the intel you want. We paid the fucking piper down there. You think this is Bell's fault? I don't know whose fault it is. I just know that Perseus doesn't have a single fucking nuke. He's got dozens. Millions of people are gonna die, and the United States will take the blame. You need to find out where he's planning to broadcast the activation signal. How are we gonna pull that out of our ass? Bell knows where it is. Bell? This goddamn science project was a failure! Don't count Adler out yet. The man has a deep bag of tricks. Well... Maybe the U.S. should take some blame for hiding nukes under all his countries. Come on, a little further. Didn't make it. Sims, get the gurney. After all, I sure did. No what happens, I never forget the people I owe. Sims, you better not get the dosages ready. All of them. Adler, stop wasting our valuable time. He's of no use to us anymore. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Stay alert, Bell. You're the key to stopping persons. No more half assing. We're doing an intracerebral injection. Oh my. I don't know if I like the sound of that. Into the brain? I know sure what I that word this. means. Uh. Do the eye socket. Uh, sure no! Get, get that away from me! Oh, that's my my aim. Oh Jesus Christ! Oh! Oh, what the fuck! Wish there was another way. What? What was that? Bell, listen to me. I need you to remember. Think back to our time in Vietnam. One more time. We need to finish what we started. We had a job to do. Okay. <laughs> uh. Think, Bell. Perseus. Do you remember coming face to face with Perseus in Vietnam? EKG is spiking. Shit. Heart rate's off the charts. I need you to relax and focus, Bell. Your helicopter crashed. You made your way through the jungle, alone. You found a bunker. Do you remember the bunker, Bell? We need to know what's inside that bunker. Okay. Why did I forget this in the first place? Do not trust Adler. Adler is lying to you. Do not trust him. Do not listen to Adler. He is lying to you. He is lying to you. During a mission to investigate reports of a Soviet bunker, your chopper was hit by ground fire. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Why have we not tried to remember this before now? The crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. Move. You ran forward and picked up an M16. I remember many details. Oh, uh, there we go. I couldn't take take the MP5 apparently, because that's not what my memory said. Oh, I can't go prone. Uh oh. Oh, this is at full auto. <laughs> Oops. 
The remaining VC fled into the tree line. It was then you realized you were the sole survivor. You set off to locate the bunker. Oh. My friends just disappear because I realized I was the sole survivor. Yeah, I wonder if I had picked up the MP5 if you would have had like... Or was it an MP5? I don't remember. Some Stanley Parable narrator. The path split near a ruin. Oh. So he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. We have a zombies map here? Shangri-La 2? Jeez. It's a nice place. Oh. Well, I'll not alert them then. I believe I alerted them. <laughs> I guess I could have gone around, maybe. The zip line nearby was the best way back into the game. You wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible. So I could do what the narrator says, or not. Bell, turn back and use the zip line to reach the bunker. What if? Adler is lying to me. What the hell? Why is Bell in scenario 11? Adler is lying to me and I need to find the truth. If you allies were pinned down on a ridge, you readied your sniper rifle to assist. Kind of surprised to let me go here. This is an interesting mission. What if I had just done what he said? Now I want to go back and pick up that MP5. <laughs> There gotta be like achievements for doing it every which way. Doing exactly what he says, doing the opposite of what he says. I like this kind of style for sure. Boom. Inside the house hit my napalm to find a hidden bunker door. What if I go back the other way? I don't think it'll let me. Yep. Now, is there a place I can go that is not what he's telling me to do? Well, that's pretty obvious. No, I think we're going with the door. The numbers! Oh Christ, what's happening? What do they mean? Oh, God. Let's up the dosage and run one B this time. Just don't stick it in my eye. Ready to go. According to your debrief, you woke up and the rest of your crew was missing. The VC were on the ground searching for survivors. According to your Ready debrief, to you had a bow. <laughs> Very interesting. They can't make a game, I guess, without doing some weird... Memories, this isn't real type stuff. Oh, you heard that, huh? At least my aiming abilities even seem to work in memory land. Implanted memory land. Or whatever's going on. <laughs> what are we gonna do this time? Well, that isn't supposed to be there. Mm hmm. The path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. They straight up were like playing Stanley Parable while making this game. We're like, oh, this is really fun. We should do that. Hmm. 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 There's a lot more stuff going on there, and I went that way last time, so we'll go down here. We'll go with it. I don't know about that. Thanks 
You heard Russian voices from a cave across the river, so you went to investigate. So many things I can do. Cool. Yeah, it's not. Don't think there's anything there. Okay, I need to play that game now. That's my mission. Can I climb up and around? To play well, that game. I need you to turn around and go into the cave. I know you do. But there's a arcade machine. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. The zip line nearby was the best way back to the cave. You wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible. I sure did. Hmm. What I really want to do is go over here. Aha! Bell's starting to drift. He's playing boxing in his memories. Aha! Aha! Okay, whatever. We're, we're done with that. But I needed to unlock it. We're back down here. What do you think? Can we go with the cave? Or we go back across there and keep denying him? It seems like the less common thing to do to keep denying him. But I also kind of want to know what's in the cave. I don't know. I want to try everything. And then go back. I, I just gotta keep saying no. Bell, turn back and use the zip line to reach the bunker. Nothing here right now. Seeing a firefight, you readied your M16. Just more interesting to see what happens this way. Yeah. Who cares if Perseus nukes all of Europe? I didn't want to go in the cave, so there. <laughs> no, Seeing shut up. I thought the helicopter had me covered. There's the red yes, door. This was the bunker entrance you described in the report. Right. Was it now? <laughs> and my mind goes blank again. No. We've got a hallway now. A lab? That doesn't sound right. Bell's in the lab. The numbers. Putting the room together. Uh huh. <laughs> Notes suggest adrenaline. That's it, Bell. That's what you were looking for. Perseus was in there. Yeah. Well, let's go inside. If I go back to the Adler room. Under the adrenaline. Mm-hmm. Whoa! Magic! Use the chair. Right. We are sitting. Another dose. We'll keep rerunning scenarios. Don't tell me I just imagined all those missions because they were building up a fake trust memory with, with me. Oh, here we are. <laughs> According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a fire. The crash survivors were defending against a beast. You took out your thumper. You readied a grenade launcher and charged ahead. I'm about to just do what he says so I don't play this a fourth time. It's very cool to see the branching, though. Are the enemies a bunch of Adlers? I think they are. 
I was too far away until now, but they're all wearing like the same tan jacket. Yeah. They really had to give me a grenade launcher. If I just sit back here, they can't really touch me. That's what I should have done. About to run out. I had an M16 the whole time. Big brain. What am I going to do this time? Hmm. Some materializing pipes. Buildings. It's getting the worse. Slit near a ruin. So you took the right fork, not the trail to the left. You should just say took the right fork instead of mentioning the trail to the left. Stop fighting, fella. Go right. I've come this far. I feel like I just have to fight, right? I don't know. If I give in now, what was the point? I don't even think I should be fighting him, but I'm just I'm just doing it now. Stubborn. Bell, take the zip line down to the river. Yeah, that'd be a good idea. Go check out the cave, huh? Go check out the cave. Take the zip line. I wanted to get there as fast as possible. Bell, go back <laughs> to the zip line. The bunker is in the caves. Go. Yeah, go in the caves, go to the bunker, and uh, save the... save the world. Can I really not go this way this time? You just get the alder face easter egg? What a funky area. Am I going in the caves after all that? Hmm. Hmm. Well, there might be another way to go, but I guess we're going in the cave. Nope. Kind of a crazy cave. It's crazy down there. That's where we're going. Your shotgun and had a bow with I did now. That's when you discovered I always try to go the way that the isn't the right way. Hmm. Never know if they're alone when I do that. There was a guy over here, right? Oh, he's clearly seeing me. Yeah, I thought there was a guy back here. Okay. <laughs> it's a pro gamer move right there. Okay, okay. No, I doubt I can go anywhere there. Just fully exploring. Trippy area. Who are these guys? Decided to rope in. Yes, they are dead. There hasn't been one generic location in this whole campaign, I feel. Which is pretty cool. Oh dear. Wham. Yes, Bell. That was the door into the Soviet bunker. Uh-huh. Drop that ladder and give me one final chance to not go in. Here we go again. We're inside. I don't care if the door was fucking stuck. Open it. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I noticed the wall change, but I didn't think when we turned back around the door would be gone. What if we get here and go all the way back? No. Still a wall. 
No, okay. Lazar, give Bell another injection. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good idea. Do it now. Those are some serious convulsions. Someone do something. Oh no. It's always getting farther away. I need to do a backwards long jump up the stairs. Yahoo! Yeah, 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 yahoo! Wait. Oh. It looks like Bell is coming down. Maybe we're okay again. Well, I just gotta play another video game in my mind. Fun! And we're done with that. We unlocked it. It's all the max. Damn it! Ah, 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 creepy. I'm getting tall. Back the other way. Back the other way. I have to crouch or I get stuck on the... This really is quite the fever dream. Bell, stop speaking in surface. Oh my god. I turned around and it was back there. I should probably go to the red door, huh? Stop wasting my time with this hallway. It's a really, really smooth... Like, wow. That is cool. It's the same, like, area, so they can flawlessly, like... Damn, that's interesting. Okay. What the lab? What the hell is Bill doing in the lab? Back in the lab again. What an experience this has been. <laughs> Just walking around. Bell, oh. forget about the damn lab. I need to know about the bunker. Into the red door. <laughs> Comrades, the United States and its allies slowly consume. Uh huh. We kind of made it. Pain, 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 pain. Don't trust that. Tell me who I am. They want to kill you. Oh no. The numbers. Nova 6. Operation Great. That wasn't very useful. Lol. <laughs> Perseus. Don't trust Adler. I don't think we have Adler. Hmm. I don't think we were. Can Bell survive another round? You're asking me? Do it. We're not leaving empty-handed. Script 17. Ready. What did I wake up to? <laughs> I picked up my RPG and... We've been over this already. Skip ahead. I'm down for that. Woo! Super fast! The bunker door was right there at the ruins, Bell. You went in. Did I though? Bell, go into the bunker now. I'm just I'm just stuck doing this at this point. Bell. I don't know if you're like I don't know what people want me to do. But I'm just committed to this path. <laughs> Perseus. 
What happened in the bunker, though? I don't know. And I don't know if I want you to know. Bell, Perseus said something to you. What was it? He said, don't trust Adler. Bell, the door. Go inside. Damn. Hmm. You're the only one who knows where Perseus is. Where he'll detonate the nukes. Where is he, Bell? Comrades. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Our leaders continue to weaken under this threat. It is the moral duty of Perseus to act when they will not. Soon we will possess an American nuclear bomb. The key to unlocking their entire green light arsenal. Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. I guess we figured it out. You gotta admit, I'm surprised. I didn't think they'd recover so fast. We tried everything. Normal forms of interrogation won't work. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years. Fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We've got a job to do. This time we're the team doing the brainwashing. We just need to give the subject a name. Bell. And it's all figured out. Fascinating. So I don't think it mattered that we avoided the door for so long. But I am curious how many ways that mission could have gone down. What types of scenarios you run into as he guides you back to the door. He's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? <laughs> Who am I? You're disoriented, Bell. We'll explain everything later. Right now, we need to help each other. You need me to help you. Bullshit. <laughs> well, it's not like I don't trust Adler. I guess. Where is Perseus? Where is Perseus? You tell us, <laughs> Bell, that's what this whole fucking thing is about. <laughs> yeah, I Bell, know. You are one of them. We think Perseus cut you out of the picture in Turkey. Adler found I you. I kind of figured alive. that. When the plane leaves trap zone, he's stopping in Dugo. This you know. Here's what you don't know Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Dugo alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. Full circle, back to the beginning, all right. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. We were there. We found you after everything went down. Here. 
Well, I believe that part. Yeah, they implanted the stuff about Vietnam or whatever. The CIA reinvented you, Bell. We needed to give you a new identity. Yes, Harry Cox. <laughs> Hudson thought we were making so a mistake dumb. by conditioning you to be an ex-KGB agent. But what else is new? And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. You were put through the CIA's MK Ultra program, though. They gave you new memories, things constructed out of Adler's. It's fucked up. But they needed you to believe you were one of us. I did a pretty good job, though, didn't I? Pretty good memory of that. You people are sick. I was never really in Vietnam. Yeah, I know that. Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. Fuck this. <laughs> what did I give to you? get us where we are today, but we're not finished yet. We have a job to do. Oh no, don't put me back in there. The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now, what we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who, in the end, has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the Green Light also, we will detonate them all for the sake of Solovets. This is your chance to define who you really are, Bell. Where is Perseus? Hmm. Well, you know. I think I'll tell him the truth. It's a little more interesting if I lie. I'm also curious if anything happens if I don't pick, but I'll probably go with the truth. Yeah, that's boring, but you know. Solovetsky. Sims, get Washington on the line. We'll see. Everyone else gear up. We're leaving now. I like how many times they said Solovetsky to make sure. And the, the truth lie thing. So that you knew what you were doing and you weren't just randomly picking because you forgot. I don't know, maybe I should have lied. You didn't stick that shit in my eye, after all. I'm doing it for you, Lazar. Because we're bros, even though we don't know each other at all. Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. Yeesh. He's got no glasses. An important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us have crossed the line. There goes the frame rate. To make sure the line's still there in the morning. There goes the frame rate again. No one's gonna brand us heroes or villains. They don't know us. As for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. <laughs> Speeding that up. Ends now. Heard of cinematic 24 FPS. Not 9 FPS. Here we go with the silent ending of the cutscene because the audio played at normal speed and the cutscene did not. <laughs> Alright, not too bad. See, if I knew Bell was going to be in the middle of my name this whole time, I could have just made my last name Sack and it would have been Harry Bell Sack. That would have been hilarious. 
So close to glory. No way I'm missing this. Motherfuckers are gonna pay for Ice and Park. Look at your chance. Solovetsky's two clicks out. All units, EMP in transit. Starfish inbound, 400 knots. When that baby Got hits, it. We'll have 12 minutes max before the radio towers come back online. Our job is to not Whoa. Have three guns and give our warbirds a clean shot. Let's take Perseus off the air. Thirty-six shot war machine. What even is this? I am dead. As my body floats in midair. I can't take cover. So I just need to shoot the right places. Which seems difficult, actually. I take out the tower, I can... See, I can't take out that car very easily because there's a car in, friendly car in front. There's two towers, which I have to kill quickly. Did better, but there are even more towers. See, those towers are shooting me way sooner than I can easily see them. I feel like this isn't supposed to be hard. Did that not take out the tower? See, like, I can't... I, I, what? I'm already dead. How? 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 How do I take out those towers? I'm trying to just, like, mortar them. I'm doing the towers, I'm doing the towers, get the other two, get the other two! It's not going down, I'm shooting the towers! How do they not go down? How high do I have to aim this thing? I guess it has a pretty quick drop. Now I'm gonna die, because I heard the, the, yep. I know I can't survive if I get hit that, that fast. No, that goes straight through, okay. Nope, I'm dead. As soon as you hear that low health sound, it's like you're not gonna survive, so. Well, I'm dead. Yep. How many times am I- This is- <laughs> seems like a bit of a bullshit section. Do I have a different gun? No, I don't. This is it. I just have to get really freaking good at judging the trajectory of this. Kill that- I know, I'm dead again. I, that seems like RNG. There was one time I got through there and I barely shot anyone and I didn't take much damage. Get this tower immediately. I don't care about my ammo anymore. Just spray. Just get this guy right away. Oh my god. Oh my god. Die, die, die. Holy moly. I still don't know if those towers went down. Why was that so absurd? Push up, push up, go, go, Get me out of this car. Oh, okay. Back to the game being way too easy because we can take cover whenever we want. Speaking of easy, <laughs> get hit by a random RPG. Where was that from? This guy? Yep. Woo! That's enough out of you. Leave we be moving up. Uh oh. Another rocket guy in the window. Alder you. I mean, I'm just gonna call him Alder, I guess, from now on. Adler. 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 Call him Adler. How many times have I said Alder and not corrected myself? I don't know. Alright, alright. I'll do, do whatever thing. There were a lot of people to take out. There are still a lot of people to take out. Uh, there you go. Fire in the hole. Mm. Nice work, Bell. Head for the church. Hi. Mason Woods, clear out any AA guns on the west wing. Adler, we're on it, Adler. Hudson. Have you cleared the AA guns? We need to go one. We got one AA clear. You know that's not good enough. I can't risk an early strike. We only got one shot at this. Then don't. I don't think I know that. Contact. Just be ready to... Ah, good. Exactly what I wanted to have. Uh-oh. That sounded like a jug or something. Hello. We are backing off. His voice was very... garbled sounding. Yep. Does every shotgun shot stagger him? I didn't want to smoke. Got 
Surely this is a lot of DPS. <laughs> God damn it. Finish him. We're losing time. Well, maybe you could help out then. You are clueless. There we go. Ah. Okay. Well, uh, it might take me a while to get over there. You gonna put a timer on my screen or nah? Is it a fake timer or a real timer? I think it's a fake one. But we'll pretend it's real, you know? Pretend there's some urgency, it makes it more fun. Those are snipers. We gotta go. We gotta plant it. Be nice if you guys could help clear behind me. Oh. Death machine. Not a kill streak yet, but it will be. There's the real timer. Yeah. Oh, that's a guy. Ear punch. I got a thing for that. I just stabbed my own arm there. I dropped him and... <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Yeah, it seems like they could have blown the gun up just fine. They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing yet. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. Not wanting to nuke all of Europe. Okay. We have that in common. What's the situation down there? Come in. Woods, have you found them yet? Over here. Give me a hand. Take my hand, Bell. We did it. This is a message to Perseus and those that'll follow him. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bell. Where's the crazy twist? Where I'm still in my mind and his face turns into Perseus's face and he's disappointed in me for Do you have an update betraying him. Javadi? Yeah. After capturing Kasim Javadi, we've convinced him he's better off working for us rather than against us. The death of Arash Kadavar opens a path for Kasim to take control of their network. He'll give us deeper insight into Soviet activity in the Middle East. And with our resources behind him, he should be able to influence regional affairs for years to come. What about Anton Volkov? After his death, Elements inside the GDR saw an opportunity to reduce the Russian mob's influence in East Berlin. Two days ago, in a large-scale midnight raid, Stasi swept through the homes of anyone with connections to Volkov. Men, women, and children were all gone before the sun rose. This will be a major setback to underground Soviet activity in Europe. How did the cleanup in Havana go? We were able to recover Agent Park's body from the compound in Cuba. President Reagan personally reached out to her family and her caskets in transit to London. My bad. We've spoken to MI6. They're understandably displeased. We owe them one. Lazar Azale is recovering from his injuries in Tel Aviv. He'll return to the agency in good time. 
pursuit of Perseus is personal for There's an entire where are they now segment about the rest of the team. <laughs> based on your choices. We got off before the Soviets could send in forces to investigate. We'll take some time to heal up, then it's back to work. We may have stopped Perseus, but his rats are still nesting all around us, thanks to the help of one of our own. Well, we did finally get Aldrich. That son of a bitch. Perseus's network is still intact, though, and they'll eventually rebuild. What about Europe? Not only did we stop a nuclear attack, we managed to take out Major Vadim Rudnik. That should be a significant blow to Perseus's European network. We didn't eliminate any of Rudnik's key assets, though. We'll have to deal with that problem down the road. Right. I and didn't Bell. Solve anything there. Arctic air. There's the head, doesn't it? Arctic air and a cigarette. Bell, you made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision of your own accord. Oh, no kiss. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me. Are you breaking up with me? It was always for the greater good. You're a goddamn hero, you know that kid. Heroes have to make sacrifices. That's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. It was never personal. Yeah, okay. Someone was dying there, and I didn't think he was just going to jump off the edge. <laughs> Had a weird feel to it. Fascinating. I don't know. <laughs> um, weird. <laughs> it was fun. Um, I really liked the gameplay side, honestly. Like I said at a couple points, there were a ton of very unique locations and styles of gameplay from massive KGB compound fake American town to embassy undercover snooping around the Vietnam jungle in my mind. I find the mindless military go here, shoot more people type of mission can get really boring and that wasn't a problem here. There was a bigger emphasis on the more task force style CIA undercover spy work, which I like. I'm sure some people are the opposite and want more shooting, but that Stanley Parable going against the narrator mission is a really fun style, I think. Easily has to be my favorite mission. Uh, on the story side of the game, alright, I guess. It wasn't an insane mindfuck like Black Ops 3. They do spell it out for you at the end, but they clearly like having their twists about what is and isn't real. Um, sure, <laughs> it was fun. Uh, I guess I wasn't super sucked in. I don't know what I'd be looking for, but it's not like anything blew me away there. Uh, maybe just because it did feel fairly short, I don't know. But that's okay, honestly I'm fine with that over having too much filler. Uh, the soundtrack I liked, it wasn't always heavily utilized, but I'm glad I turned it up halfway through. I mean, listen to the background right now, Jackwall still knows how to make a menu theme. One other thing I really like is that there's a decent replayability factor. There are the challenges I'm going to look through in a sec, on top of the normal achievements, and there was also a fair amount of decision making, so you can see how some things would have played out differently when you go back through. I'm really looking forward to replaying the memory mission to see how that goes. I assume it plays out very similarly even if you go to the door right away, but still interesting. Maybe the last comment is the difficulty felt a little off. I don't think I'm anything special at the game, and it felt very easy outside of the insane glitchy helicopter section because I didn't keep the stims, that's probably why they were put there, honestly. And then that jeep, I guess, at the end took a dozen or so tries, but it's weird for there to be no super hard option anymore, when even the thing above veteran is a bit of a joke. It'd be cool if you could unlock a realistic type thing after beating it, at least. I can't see that taking them a ton more effort other than needing to rebalance it for certain sections like the Helicopter of Doom to make sure it's beatable. Like maybe just turn it back to realism mode health when you're in one of those out of your control situations. Oh well, it was a fun game. I liked it. Didn't feel too serious. I enjoyed the gameplay. The challenges and decision making is a cool touch. And yeah, I guess it fit what I was looking for. Yep, oh, and the Infotech names are layered on top of each other.
<laughs> There's a bug in the credits? Every part of this game, man. There's some kind of bug. <laughs> Too funny. The campaign was a pretty smooth experience, alright? There was the glitchy helicopter. And, you know, it played okay. I crashed one time. That's not bad. It's not like... You know, some games are pretty damn awful. Like, I don't know, the Mass Effect Andromeda. Like, just seeing those atrocious... All right, the, the game worked, you know? Not exactly the highest expectation for it to work, but it was all right. And that is all. All right, let's look at some achievements. Um, that's what that was for. Just get five kills each with a bunch of guns. That's why it was easy. I'm really more interested in what I didn't do. Ashes to ashes. What is that? I thought I did everything. See all seven memory endings and play through all four paths in Break On Through. Wow, there's a lot to do there. Enemy with the bow while ziplining. Easy enough, I guess. Knock down 15 metal targets. Oh, I was probably close to that. Oh, multiplayer of zombies. Okay. Uh, nothing crazy there except for ashes to ashes. Would I have to look that up? Oh, okay. Uh, it says it's the final mission where I chose to lie to Alder. So I'll obviously do that at some point. Should we try to do that now? Hey, why not? Yeah, let's go. Skip, 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 skip. I'm not going to go back and do every other choice and like, you know, all seven endings of that memory thing or whatever, but uh, if there's a whole different mission that we can do by lying, then I mean, it makes sense that there is one in the different location that we lie about. Well, now yeah, I should probably play that. And then I did want to look at the challenges as well, because it's not just achievements. There's a whole challenge thing, too. Precious thanks to Hylia. Then why did you them. just tell me all that? You people are sick. Are your hands clean, Bell? Yes. I was never really in no. Vietnam. Count yourself lucky. You've only had those memories for a few months. Me? I've been living with them for over a decade. Where is Perseus? From the safety of the Well, I want to nuke all of Europe because you shot me in the end. Let's gear up. We're leaving now. Here we go. <laughs> interesting, interesting. You made the right choice. Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha. We'll leave within the hour. Ho 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 ho. Nice. What if I didn't do that? There was like a countdown timer. What if we went there without letting them know? NATO intelligence detected a powerful signal of unknown origin. The new signal created radio disruptions worldwide. Not to mention all kinds of conspiracy theories. NATO quickly tracked it to this facility in the Soviet Republic of Ukraine. The Duga Radar Array. It's an over-the-horizon radar system. Big improvement over their old missile defense tech. It uses a lot of juice. Could be used to broadcast any kind of long-range signal they want. Like detonation codes to every green light nuke in Europe. Where exactly is this thing? About 60 miles north of Kiev, between the cities of Pripyat and Chernobyl. It's nothing but thick forest for miles around. A perfect hiding spot for Perseus. Or so we'll you think. You in a little further out. No recon, no heavy support. Just a light infiltration squad. Shouldn't be a problem. Just point the way. Uh, sorry, Woods. through for us in the nick of time. I sure did. I never doubted it. Well, you should have. Here we go, watching the rest of the slow cutscene. Adler, no contact over here. Place seems empty. Same. I haven't seen shit. All right. Everyone converge on the gate. I feel like such a snake. Is this a multiplayer map? Because it looks like it. You sure you're not forgetting something, Bill? Oh yeah, I'm sure. There's nothing here. This can't be the right place. We didn't see anything on our side either. It's him! He fucking lied to us! That true, Bill? Yep. You pull us out to the middle of nowhere rushes so Perseus can detonate those nukes? You underestimated me. Goodbye, Adler.
Well, that's a bit close to me. Thanks. I'm hit. Taking cover. Yeah, no kidding, you're hit. The Good thing the RPGs in this game are weak as hell. On your feet, comrade. Ready for a little retribution? <laughs> oh. You can your mind, no, I don't think I can right now. I'm on this team now. Eliminate your former team. You don't want me on the enemy side. Sorry, Mason. Oh, damn. I saved your life, Lazar, but now... Too bad. Sorry, Woods. Damn. Imagine if I was on the enemy team the whole time. I'm stopping Black Ops 2, 3, and 4 from ever happening. It was never personal, Adler. This is it. Your friend went through here. He is not far. Come out and play. You are running out of time. And space. The cat becomes the mouse. Oh. Glad to see you still care. Mind giving me a light? Yeah, sure. Tap. I will tap. Ooh. Damn. That street dog should have been put down long ago. No, he kills me. <laughs> you remember my face, don't you? Yep. Solovetsky, stand by for the detonation order. I think you deserve this moment, comrade. Aww. The West falls today. I wish we could return to Solovetsky to watch it all unfold, but that chapter is closed now. We begin the next one together. You did well. Thanks. And to think, after all this time, they still believe I'm Perseus. <gasps> the ultimate twist. As if Perseus could ever be an individual working alone. So American. Ah, we are Perseus. We'll need a new home now. The Central Committee will be more surprised than the CIA. Even if we made the best choice for the future of our homeland. Hmm, yet. For humanity. Their eyes will be as clouded as ours once were. Come. There is still much to be done. Green light nukes did he detonate? All of them, Mr. President. Does anyone know the bombs were ours? Materials we <laughs> the first concern. Green light were anonymously released an hour ago, presumably by Perseus. Calls are beginning to come in from across the globe. That son what of a an bitch. insane mess that would be. You and Vice President Bush are to be moved to secure locations immediately. I want any business related to this thing erased forever. Everything. Can you make that happen? Of course. It's already begun. Good luck with that. Okay. We 
will watch Europe burn. We will watch the Empire of the United States collapse under its own weight. A world with two superpowers will become a world with one. The Soviet Union. And if the leaders of this new world order squander the opportunity we have provided them, then they too will be replaced. Kasim Javali. He fell into the hands of your former CIA friends. Kasim is too soft. I will need you to personally supervise his erasure. We get the where are they now from Perseus's point of view. It is a shame you had to kill Anton Volkov. He was our most valuable GDR asset. But perhaps with the fall of the West, it will not prove so great a blow. So if you wanted the ultimate ending for this version, you would have not done the optional missions. Just let him survive. You say that Helen Park perished in Cuba. She had been sniffing around the edges of our group for years. One less Western nuisance for us to deal with. <laughs> As for the rest, it was a pleasure eliminating them by your side. Yeah, that's another question I have with the whole decision tree, because I radioed ahead to set up that ambush. What if I didn't? Would that yellow text option not be there for starting the ambush? And they'd just be like, well, thanks for dragging us out here, and that's it? Unfortunately, our key asset within the U.S., Robert Aldrich, was killed. Our spiring there is still intact, but we will need to rebuild and find new leadership. Yeah, you're welcome. I didn't solve the puzzle. The death of Major Vadim Rudnik is a terrible loss for post-nuclear Europe. He was to help shepherd in the Soviet-aligned future. Hopefully, we can still move forward without his presence there. Fortunately, the CIA didn't eliminate any of Rudnik's three key assets. They will help fill the void left by his absence. Yep, yep. But I have no doubt, these are but temporary losses. We are just getting started, my friend. Didn't go the extra mile. There's the ashes to ashes. Okay, we got the other achievement for that mission. Let me skip in that, already watched. Well, I'm glad we got that in there, and I'm also glad I chose that second. Because clearly the first one was the more, uh canon uh, proper ending where the right characters survive this is the more fleshed out one the more triumphant one even though we get uh, murdered let's take a look at the challenges now Do -do -do. we did 37 percent without trying okay two separate playthroughs of end of the line i forget what end of the line is follow all of all those orders okay that makes sense yeah i thought that might be a thing we have to do the extra mission stuff. Refuse to light a cigarette, understandable. Bit of an alternate ending there. Cool, cool, got lots of stuff to go through and do, I like it. Not gonna do it now, obviously. Drive under three vehicles, oh, I was kinda scared to do that. Oh yeah, there's the sticks and stones thing. I, all right, I'm good at making up challenges. 45 seconds or more, well, I can just do this stuff on recruit and run, run by everyone. Only rockets, well, that's easy enough. All easy stuff. And there's only five. Okay, yeah, you can 100% you can that pretty quick. Then there's a Dark Ops. That was easy. And I'm guessing these are, I mean, there's nothing that could really be that hard. You just look up how to do everything. Okay, well, that's cool. Some reasons to go back through, play some more. Very cool. I already gave all my thoughts and stuff, so that's all. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out for another campaign playthrough. I'll catch you next time.